But we're going to load from last save, because, yeah. Schnooze. Because we don't like ads around here. But this will be the second part of Dragon's Dogma 2, um, since we're back again with this. I do get a little bit of frame drops here in, in town. Um, I don't know why I just got 400 gold randomly. I, I guess bumping into people gives me money. Or somebody looted something, I don't know. One way or the other, but... <clears throat> we're supposed to be able to get, like, a weapon for our vocation. Is this guy the weaponsmith? Oh, Klaus sent word that you've agreed to rescue some of my pilfered equipment. I never agreed to that. I'd be grateful for aught you can reclaim, truly. I mean, I'll do it just to do it, but... Are behind these ox cart raids, I've since learned. No doubt they're hoarding the stolen arm from the Televit. Their lair lies somewhere along the western road. Okay. Pray do be careful. If aught were to go awry... Would weigh heavily on my heart. Return of modded lethal company tomorrow. Nice. And then Elden Ring co-op playthrough. That's what's up. Okay. Losing my wares for good would make me sore. But no That's awesome. Gold I don't think I could uh I don't think I'd want to go back to Lethal Company. It was fun for a little bit, but I don't know. The base idea of the game's just not gonna change, and so it's like eh. And the mods making it crash all the time is just a humongous pain in my butt, so. Not terribly, uh, not terribly excited to do that. Okay, so there's nothing in here that I really need, so. <clears throat> okay. Two to make a sale, and this seller had nothing to tempt us with. I did speak with that guy, so let's take a look at the map here. Where is this? Turn to world map. Okay, so this is where the vocation stuff is. So there's going to be some goblins over here, from the sounds of it. It's a better spend elsewhere. So yeah. Enough to scratch the itch in my case. Do we have uh yes, we do have our pool party still. So we're good to go. We don't need to mess around with any of that. Um I probably should rest at an inn. Do I have enough money to rest at an inn though? I do, okay. So I think I should probably uh rest in an inn so that way I'm full health and I'm ready to go. I've heard so hey Reaper, how's it going? Welcome in, how you doing? How you doing? If you it's really same Z's after a while for sure. Don't mind returning for the occasional romp with friends. Yeah, I agree, Titanium. It's fun with friends, but it's one of those things where I don't think I could play it permanently or like over a long course of time. Just because like I would get bored of it really fast. So it would kinda put me to sleep. Gonna watch, I got my popcorn and your water. <laughs> Hell yeah, Reaper, that's what's up. Well, welcome in. Welcome into the party. So, I actually have, um... Normally I don't, uh... Normally I don't tend to stick with, like, caffeinated drinks or, like, sugary drinks or anything like that. But, for a stream, I did, um... Grab a, uh, couple of energy drinks for the in-case-of-emergency situation where i do end up getting tired um hopefully i don't have to drink them but <clears throat> you know they are they are there for that purpose so we'll see um like i said i i don't particularly want to use them but uh i have them as a, a just in case type thing so that'll be there um where was the exit was it this way i think it was this way hope that's some 24 hour popcorn yeah, you're gonna need uh, you're gonna need a big bucket for it to last 24 hours. I'll tell you what. Try to keep up. That's gonna be a big bucket of popcorn right there. I'll tell you what. Okay, so we're leaving town, and we need to head that general direction. I haven't discovered I haven't discovered that part of the map yet, <clears throat> so. We'll see what lies over there. Who's stuck over there? Hustle up. Pawn, what are we doing? Slacking. Chester, come on. You should be able to run faster than this. What are we doing? See, now you speed up. Freaking Chester. Slack a lacking. I expect more of you. Master. Should be running on Cheeto energy. To rid yourself of any excess items. Do I have excess items? I probably should have checked that. <clears throat> I do. So, I have quite the heavy load right now, which is kind of bad. 
I probably should have stashed some stuff. I still can go back and actually do that, which I might do, because this way is kind of a lot. Um, and then we should sell that at some point for some extra money. We need to pick up some of those beetles along the way, because they are actually really nice for doing the let's thing. See. So, do yeah, let's, uh, let's go back real quick, because it's not far. So we'll just hit the end real fast, store some stuff. And then we'll go back, because I definitely don't want to start off the adventure being overweight. Even though we'll probably run into some of those beetles that extend your weight. Um, it did just be easier to not deal with it. That's the bench. <clears throat> Alright. Let's see. The inn, I think, is this way? plentiful hereabouts. Yeah. We could pick some now and use them when the need arises. We could or we could not. There is that option as well. Well met. You will soon forget the fatigue of a long journey when treated. Organized deposit. Okay, so we need to definitely get rid of our materials here because yes. Because um, we can use those anytime. We don't have to have those on our person. Um, to serve in the making of arrows. Okay, that might be helpful for Chester, but I'm not particularly interested in keeping it around. We don't really have, like, a lot of stuff on us. I really just don't even know what's weighing us down so much, to be completely honest with you. Do I have one of those backpack things? I don't. <clears throat> All right. Actually, um, we need to deposit from Chester as well. I think... Oh, I need that on my person. That's for sure. Get that off them. He doesn't need this anymore. Doesn't need that. Um, These are worse for him, so he doesn't need those either. Might as well off some... Stuff that's unnecessary. That's not necessary either at the moment. Yeah, we should be good. We should be good with that, to be honest. And then I can take the uh, the beetle for the extra storage. Much obliged. Cancel. All right. So now we do actually have some space to work with, which is great because we're gonna need to we're gonna need to use that. Give to me, then use said item. Oh, keep hitting right because I think it's like options, but it's not. It doesn't do anything. At your <clears throat> All right. Now we can actually get going with what we were doing, which I think was this way. Yeah. Tis a ladder. Should we see where it leads? I wonder where the uh, I wonder where the port crystals are arisen? in this one. I also don't think I've gotten any fairy stones yet, either, which <clears throat> would make our life a little bit easier returning to town. Restricted entry, yes. Okay, well, that's not exactly where I was trying to go. Do you know how long you'll be? I only ask so that I might adopt the most effective stance to recuperate my strength. I have no idea, Stones good sir. we can do is wait. Okay. Now we're actually going to get going. That's what we're going to do. Now that we've actually got some space, we've got some rest. It still should be good enough as far as daylight hours. And if it's not, we have two camping kits with us, so we'll clear out a spot if we need to. We purchased all that we require. We ought to review the contents of our packs just to be sure. Um, yep, we've purchased everything that I can afford. So, there's a glad thing we rested when we did. Try not to get hit, lest all that film go to waste. The foremost priority is to douse those flames. Oh, we're burning them. We're burning them, all right. Okay, 
Okay. Uh, there should be one more, I think. Throw down healing for these guys. Many thanks for healing me, Arisen. In you go, Kratos. There you go. I'll throw up another one because this guy didn't... Oh, no, we're, we're good. It's fine. Some of these materials I probably just fill up a lot on, like goblin horns. Like, there's a ton of goblins everywhere. That's probably a material I'm going to fill up pretty quickly on. So, I may not need to pick up all of them. What is over here? I don't know what you guys are seeing. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. Is there anything in here? A little watchtower, eh? Any goodies? There is a chest. A treasure chest. Igneous oh, melody. Wait to open it. Okay, some explosive arrows. All chests contain treasure, you know. Mm, nothing over there. Oh, there is a chest right there. Give me the loot. I would have liked to see an FOV slider in here as well. Um, just because I feel like the FOV is a little too close. Ow, oh, calm down. Calm down. There is so many harpies up here. Oh my. That works. You didn't drop me far, punk. Oh, Chester might go down though. Nope, yep. Nope, Chester's super dead. This is the worst place for these guys. Okay, can we cause them to knock out of the sky? With this? Nope. Nope, oh, and we're asleep. Having harpies up here is terrible. <clears throat> of course there's harpies up here. This is actually the worst place for them. So, of course they'd be up here. And I can't see a dang thing. Yeah, I'm getting cucked by the camera super hard. I also haven't checked if there's a setting for, um, the, like, moving my camera while I have a spell out because it's so freaking slow. That specific spell is terribly slow. Like, it's awful. Okay, there's one down. Oh. There's one in here. Oh, Chester came back up here. Okay. Oh, I think he I think he went and go I think he went to go grab him. That's great. Okay. If you could not, there's nowhere else to go, but alright. Okay, I'm gonna throw this up. Oh, of course you get knocked down. As soon as I want to burn you. <laughs> of course you do. All right, Chester. This uh, this little area is a little disorienting because it's kind of close quarters. I think Kratos probably dropped down somewhere too. Mm, yep. Let's fire boom. Oh. These harpies are the worst, dude. I need to... Nope, that's not the spell I wanted. Here we go. Where's this other harpy? Okay, well, I need to go down and get Kratos. Otherwise, he's going to disappear. I wonder if that meter recharges after a time, the like their little death meter thing. I think it does, hopefully. If not, then that's gonna suck, but I think it should. Okay, well, note to self, never go up to that tower again. Because those harpies are not worth dealing with up there. That is such a crowded space for no good reason. So 
Yeah, no thanks on that again. We got what was up there, and I will never be returning. Never going up there again. That was a horrible, horrible time. Here's a campsite, but the real question is, is there any mobs nearby? I mean, we're doing pretty good on health, so... I think it's probably fine to skip this one, because there's probably going to be another camp somewhere... Soonish, hopefully. We'll see. We must each of us own our skills. The master, goblins. We all in the same boat. Ooh, nice. Got two goblins with that. No one can defend themselves when grappled. Yeah, this is a nice little long-range spell. I'm out of stamina, though. Which is something I definitely need to be watching. I probably never will. I keep saying that, but it's probably never going to happen. If I'm being honest. To me. That way you guys can get some heals. One might confidently call that a resounding victory. Well, I'm sure there's still room for improvement. Oh, hey, another beetle. Gimme, gimme. Yeah, those increase your weight. I wonder if they, uh, I wonder if those respawn. Because then you could just sit at a spot and keep getting more of those. That'd be interesting. I do wonder. A common reward. Frustratingly so. We'll find a use for it, I'm sure. Oh yeah, Chester. We're gonna be eating grapes. There is plenty to go around on this trip. Ooh, some bark. Don't mind if I do. No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. The early griffin gets the worm, as they say. We might as well hit these guys before they hit us, because they're most likely going to come to us anyway, so... Might as well. Oh. I thought he did a... I thought he was trying to do, like, a cartwheel, like, type of move to get away, but I think he just got smacked. I didn't see by what, but... <laughs> There we go. Perfect. Easy peasy. What's in here? Is there anything up there either as well? So that'd be interesting to see. There might be a chest up there. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here. Um I'd say we collect that as much as we might carry. be something? No, it's just a log. Well, it sounds like there's something. Oh, let's say it sounds like there's something ferocious around. That's not too ferocious. Oh wow, he's getting messed up though. Thank you, Chester, for bringing him closer to me. That helps out a ton. Nope. That's the one I wanted. There we go. I'm glad it doesn't waste any of your uh, stamina to start the cast. Because that would be... Uh, I'd be a little bit screwed if that was the case. I'm horrible at starting the wrong cast. That is I something I'm terrible at. Fierce foes and That's fine. Wanted to get the scales. Not necessarily have a conversation there, Kratos. No, thank you. Sounds good, Titanium. Appreciate the lurk, man. You enjoy your lurk. I do kind of think that speed spell might be something that's useful later. I don't know how useful fire is going to be, but... Thank you, good sir. I do need to kind of get a decent vantage point here. Help out Rock over there. Oh, 
Oof. I kind of staggered him for a moment. That's helpful. No, I'm getting him. I'm getting him. Maybe. I'm actually a bit winded. There we go. Now he's gonna get the aggro, which is exactly what we need. <clears throat> and that was all of them, huh? Okay, cool. I don't know if that was a good way to take or not, but I'll take the XP. We shall have to find a way to reach it. You're well fond of picking things up, aren't you? Absolutely. Wolves. Oh, he's just talking boulder, so <laughs> alright, dude. We're just going ham on the boulder tossing, huh? Top everybody up that needs it, if anybody needs it. I don't think anybody got hurt during that fight, but screw it. That's a pretty good heal. Okay, so it looks like there's maybe a chest on top of this cliff. How in the world I'm gonna get up there though? is an entirely different question. Uh, perhaps this will seem of little consequence, but some masters rearrange their party at the drop of a hat. One mm. such person dismissed me after only half a day of service. Maybe. I'll Isn't be sure to keep that in mind. I should like a paraglider, that'd be cool. I know this isn't like Breath of the Wild or anything, but I do have the, uh, I can actually levitate as a, as a mage. So technically, I kind of do when I think about it. I just realized that. Okay, so... Yeah, we could go around, I think. we could achieve if we honed our talents further. Yeah, there's bones. There's probably goblins. Ooh, there's a griffin up there. Okay. Hello. I can't wait to find out what's inside. We're coming close on the objective, though. What is that? Just a regular wolf? Yep, sure is. What are you fighting? What's big down there? I wonder if making camp right here would cause this griffin to like attack because I did mention that like if you don't clear out like mobs and stuff when you do the camp like they could attack you at night I wonder if that's something that could just happen as the griffin messes your camp up you know I, I bet it is silver ore kind of sucks that you only get one resource out of those now because I remember like in the first one you could get up to like five per mine generally used as a material I found a goblin layer. Materials result in different creations. Okay, so this is where the tool should be. Shall we proceed into the depth? We best be prepared to make our own light before we proceed. Oh, he got toasted. Didn't even need that. Lantern on. Oh, hello, shield guy. I hate these guys. They're, they're so annoying in this one. So, so much worse. I also need to remember to be booning these guys. Right, you must cleanse yourself of that oil for taste. Because that'll definitely help combat it, especially with these goblins. Another mining spot. What are we going to get today? Silver ore. Nice. Very nice. Pick up every little thing you find and your pack will soon outweigh you. Well, yep. I know it, yet I cannot seem to resist. Oh, I'm going to pick you up say, everything. I'm glad I'm not the only one. Oh, we're going to we're going to definitely have a heavy pack. That's for sure going to happen. I'm glad you can cast like lightning and stuff indoors. I was figuring you might not be able to, but I'm glad you can. I know it's not, it doesn't really like exactly come from the sky, but it's just like a higher spell, if that makes sense. So it's 
kind of what I was thinking, possibly. Thank you for getting him off my back. Because you guys are kind of slacking. Hey, we're already at five with mage. That's not bad. I need to I need to get more discipline though, so I can actually like get some more spells going. Because I really don't have a lot. These punks, you guys are slack a lacking. Granted, I should be a little bit further back, but these guys aren't exactly taking the initiative to go forward at the moment. So I'm kind of having to lead them into battle. Which I do have the go setting on. So I don't know why they're not. All right, what's in the box? Two-hander. Ooh, nice, a greatsword. So that's going to be for the, uh, the warrior vocation, which I could turn... Well, somebody into gathering items and am ever on the hunt for new finds i'll gladly try out all right fair enough what is in here no goodies cool opening locked doors what does that have to do with anything okay well i tried to hit tab and you just went into the map oh i have to hold it i see uh, but cannot be open to my keys. This can be merely a matter of timing. Find such drawers at a particular time of day, or you progress to a certain point in the story. Gotcha. So it doesn't seem like maybe they have the, uh, because in the first one they had, like, barricades on the other side of the door that you just walk around and break, and they're essentially, like, a shortcut, but it doesn't seem like maybe that's the case in this one. All right. I shall do as goblins approach. Yeah, you guys, <clears throat> you guys go on ahead. Brock has taken the longest time, and he's literally like the one that should be going first. Because he's the warrior, or he's the fighter, so he, he's the one that's going to grab all the attention. So I feel like the, uh, I feel like the AI is a bit better, but it seems like it's a little sluggish to react so far. Which is not the greatest thing, but it's not something we can adjust to. Rangers tights. This is probably be great on Chester. I'll turn you into a pink cushion. Is this going to target anybody? Okay. It targeted somebody around the corner. Even though I think there, I think there was somebody that wasn't around the corner. Maybe not. Maybe they might have taken him out. This bridge is definitely a breakable bridge. That is for sure. Got to get across to get the loot, though. Explosive arrows. Okay. Chester could use those. And some copper ore. Oh, we can grab multiple times. Okay. It just seems like the ones I got before were just not able to be grabbed multiple times. It's probably just an RNG thing. Um, all right. So we need to dump some weight here because we have a bunch of stuff. Uh, we could use this, get a little bit extra weight capacity. Well, how much does this weigh? Four kilograms? Okay, that's pretty heavy. I'm going to give that to... I'll give that to Kratos for now, because I don't really plan on using that at the moment. And then Ranger's Tights, we can give that to Chester, because he might use those... And then, what is this? Ring of Awareness. Reduces accumulation of the wearer's sleep value. Okay. That'd be good for, like, harpies. You can swap over to that during, like, situations where there's harpies. Okay, these are, what? Maybe a pound or a kilogram total, which isn't terrible. I mean, I guess we're doing okay for now. I do need to go get Kratos up. Where did he even fall? Oh, he fell all the way down. Oof. I need to throw up a heal for Rock here. 
I'm gonna need to burn this punk. That was, uh, I think that was a uh, more elite goblin. One of them, anyways. Oh, did he, did he bring him up here? Where, where, where did he go? Oh, no, he's right below me. Gotcha. What is that sound? Is it this? For a moment, I thought I'd met my end. Okay, that is an oh, awful sound. It's like a, like, ping noise constantly when they're down like that. That is terrible. Not the biggest fan of that sound. What do we have here? More cave. I wish um I wish there was a like a spell kind of like the uh, the one that lights up the area, but it was like um it was like a little light that would follow you around, like or like kind of go a little bit ahead of you, so that way you could like light forward if that makes sense. All right, you guys gotta go. Thanks for healing me, Arisa. Can't be the one leading the charge as a mage, no sir. I'm gonna get slapped up. I don't have any defense <clears throat> or skills to really deal with melee at all. At least at the moment. Maybe there is some other stuff that you can get that's uh, focused on that, but not at the moment that I have. I'm gonna strike this guy with some lightning. That does some pretty solid damage to those guys. It's probably because they're heavily armored. That makes sense. I did my best to match your Ooh, skill. Nice. Give him the high five. Ooh, and this is probably the uh sorcerer's thing, huh? I do want to try sorcerer, because they probably have some crazy good damage. Ring of cooling. That's probably for uh maybe catching on fire, maybe. I would imagine. That that would make sense. The other chest has got to be down here somewhere, though, for the, uh, the Arc Staff or whatever. I think it's called the Arch Staff. So whatever the staff needed for the Sorcerer is. Savagery Extract and 150 bucks. Exactly what I needed. Can I push these? Your ability to trip over nothing never ceases to amaze me. Oh. Well, that immediately broke. <laughs> Guess not. I was I was gonna try to push it. Alright, we're gonna give you a buff, because you guys need it. I'm gonna cast lightning because this guy's weak to it. All right, we're gonna get a healing off real quick. Hold on. I do wish I had like a projected healing. It kind of sucks that I am. I currently only have one that's stationary, because that means that means they have to come to me or my general vicinity, which is is bad for aggro. Push it. There we go. I don't know if that's actually going to take anybody out or not, but we're going to do it anyways. Oh, you punk. Get out of here, prick. We should be able to move this boulder with our combined might. I nah. say we give it a push and see what happens. We don't need combined might. Might I be of assistance? I was able to push the other one just fine. Come on now. I shall not fail you. Okay. I guess this one just doesn't want to budge. Gotcha. Just yonder. Looks to be a good spot for harvesting ingredients. Mm, doesn't know. Some now and use them when the need arises. Our pack is well too full at the moment, but I will grab these. I think this is probably what you're talking about, but I am gonna grab this for upgrades. Use this stuff all the freaking time. 
One thing that was like a convenience thing that I didn't really like was um, whenever you're doing like a mining spot like that, you can't just hold the button. You have to like keep pressing it, which it kind of seems like is the case here. Kind of sucks. Okay, so hold on. I need to do an area map here because... Did we not find the, uh, there should be a chest in here for, okay, so it looks like maybe there's a little path we didn't explore over there. Because we still need to find the staff. Because there should have been two weapons. We got the greatsword already. Which is for the, uh, warrior. Okay, but I can't go through that door. That's why we didn't go through there. Because I can't get through there. I'll get that for you. Will you now? Oh, you'll get me money. Okay. See, you weren't talking about the door. You were just talking about cash. Gotcha. Cool. Looks like maybe there's another way down this way. Yeah, okay. It's just a little extra layer underneath here, huh? Oh, no. This is where we were before. And that led down there. Was there anything up this way, though? Okay, this looks new. Danger might lurk anywhere. Ooh, yeah, this might be it. Mind the ceiling. Is this the Archer Staff? Grievous Horns. This is the Archer Staff. Okay, sweet. So we have the vocation stuff now. Great. I think I should still be able to wear most of the same stuff um, that I have on if I were to switch over to Sorcerer. I do want to stay mage for a bit just to max out the vocation and see what it offers, but I do definitely also want to try out Sorcerer as well, because um, if they have the same augments like they had in the first one, Casting Time is, is one of the augments they had, and that one's incredible. So I would much appreciate having that. We got put into the over-heavy category, huh? <clears throat> Very heavy. Really now? You mustn't shirk your duty, lest you forget it is the arisen we serve here. Somebody's shirking. It's probably Chester. He's probably slacking. We give him a little bit more leeway. His reasons. He provides the snacks, remember? All right. Out of the cave we go, and back to possibly the town. At least to check out the new vacation stuff that we have, because I do want to see if there's any other additional things that I could buy. Because we should have a bit of discipline now that we can actually purchase stuff. Be on your guard. Oh, there man. are innumerable corners where an enemy might conceal themselves here. Oh, yeah. Let us proceed with caution. Out of the cave at last. Yeah, Hopefully, stifling to be sure. I suppose it's so. Hopefully, there's nothing over here by this camp. I don't know if that's a bandit. It's not. It's an arisen. Okay, it's not arisen, but it's a uh, pawn. Use a camping kit. I don't know why they have to weigh seven kilograms. Can't make them more like lightweight. Sheesh. And it's raining. Now we've the vim to tackle the day ahead. Um I guess I probably should have checked to see if there was any other options. Nope. Knowing when to use curatives is my specialty. Mm, okay. I urgen. Two thumbs up. Nah. I don't need to spend rift credits to uh, get a new pawn right now. And I would also definitely not want to travel during the night, because night in this game is kind of wild. We get all sorts of crazy mobs out at night. I've got good feeling about Especially skeletons and uh, those, those freaking spectral like ghost things. I mean, we have the elemental damage to deal with them, but they're a massive pain in the butt, so... I try not to as much as I can. We're not too far away from town, which is good, because we could just quickly run back real fast, and then as far as whatever else goes, we can do some exploring. Now there's a worthy prize. 
If only it weren't so far away. Yeah, I don't know how to get that up there. I think it's up there. Somewhere in that general vicinity. Here's another campsite. Ooh, another rift zone. Snag that, get some rift credits. I think the only thing right now you can really spend those on is uh, mostly just getting pawns. I think you can also get the uh, the customization thing as well, but I don't actually know where to get that. So, I don't terribly need those at the moment in high quantities. I will definitely later, but at the moment, it's not the biggest priority. I suppose there can be no harm in bringing this along. It will find a use for it. No harm at all. Ooh, some cinnamon bark. And keep a three. Okay, I'll take it. I was only expecting to get one. I don't feel like I remember getting higher quantities than one before, but like I said, I'll take it. I'm sure we'll use it for something. Thank you, good sir. What the? Freshly rested as we are. This is back to oh. Since when was there a freaking cyclops in here? I have no idea when there was a cyclops in here. Also, where's Chester? He's slack. Is there another one somewhere? Oh, yeah, there is. Okay, now we need to take out this big boy. Okay. I guess the tree blocked my line of sight, apparently. That's not doing crap for damage, tell you what. Calm it down. Oof. That is such a massive hit radius, and I cannot run fast enough to get out of it. I need to heal. Super bad. I think these guys were weak to lightning, if I remember correctly. What are you doing? He's like holding his face running around. Did somebody slap off a tusk? We might have. It seems we have enraged our foe. I'm glad the other pawns like help out. Like random pawns around the map or, or like random NPCs will actually like help out with stuff, which is really nice. Nope, that's not what I want. Damn it. Okay, you gotta move. Oh, or just continue walking. That's fine too. Yeah, like I, it's really annoying that I gotta, I gotta see if that's a setting I can change because like holding it doesn't literally do anything. This guy feels a lot stronger than the other ones we've faced for whatever reason. Thank you, Chester. Okay, that staggered me. What a prick. Dude, that reach is insane, dude. There's no way to get away like there's no way to get away from that for me. Like once he starts coming after me, like I'm I'm just gonna get slapped. That is so irritating. Yeah, I really I really need to go get some more skills, because right now I'm not really the biggest fan of the circle healing. Or at least what it provides. There's a thing to give me better healing. Okay. Gotta move. Grabbing larger foes. Um, you can push or pull them to draw their focus or knock them off balance. Oh, they're grabbing them. I don't know how they didn't pull them. I guess I could have technically gotten on them, but... Yeah. It's fine. Oh. 
also the premiums in this specific area do seem to be a bit worse now that like we've gotten later into the game for whatever reason like we we're, weren't having too much issue with it but it seems like for this specific area we're kind of getting some uh, some drops here we might have to mess with some settings after this specific interaction oh, that's doing a crap load of damage okay I guess the uh, the arm is the way to go instead of the head for some reason. Okay, so canceling was pretty quick. Oh, no one's gonna grab me. Help me out. Ooh, nice. That did work out. some stamina regen i think it's because the armor probably like if they don't if he doesn't have any armor on his head it's not really worth doing it that's probably why the uh the lightning's working better on like the limbs and stuff because they're more armored parts which makes sense there we go 118 discipline and another level up. Let's go. Given Kratos the old high five. That's what you like to hear. All right, now back to town. <clears throat> Guy was definitely not there before. That's fine. Extra XP is never a bad thing. Also, Chester could probably get some good stuff for his vocation now. He's gotten a few level ups now. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. I say we collect as much as we can carry. I'd wager there's ought to be found here. Okay, so while we have a second, let's take a look at settings, graphics. Um, so our processing load was much lower than last time, but it seems like we're getting less like quality overall or less uh, frames, I should say. Reduce input delay incurred by your system. Improve frame rate. Um, ultra performance, I guess. Sure, let's try that. Wonder how best to proceed. Seems a bit better. Does look a little blurry though. The sight of Yonox cart has brought all my fatigue to the fore. Shall we climb aboard? Is there One hopes these carts offer comfort commensurate to their cost. There is an ox cart. Well, can we just like randomly pay for an ox yeah, cart on the way? Shall you while I see. I, I thought you could just do these in town. Let me see. Ox carts bound for the checkpoint rest town. I'll need to see some coin before I let you on. Checkpoint Rest Town. Where is that? I don't know. I mean, I don't really need it. The, the, the actual town is right here, but I was just curious where it was going. Do I need to get on that bridge to get into town? I think I do. That's fine, we can just go around. Because we could go around to the other entrance, which I think is over that way. Which is totally fine. And I guess we could try to climb this. See if this is easily climbable. If it's not, then we could just go a different route, but could be easy to, to get to this. Oh, hello. Welcome to the party. Hey, booty. -hee. How are you doing? Welcome in. How's it going? How are we doing? Thank you, master. I feel much better. Let's get some crispy goblin on the menu. There we go. Oh, 
Uh, seems like they got that guy handled. Okay. Good enough, I guess. Good. Good. The game's good. It's also uh, it's also awesome to hear you're doing well. Always, always a good sign. The game's good. Um, I was kind of seeing a little bit of performance stuff, uh, issues-wise, um, a minute ago, but we messed with some settings, and we seem to be doing a lot better. Um, there is a bit of a blur now. I need to maybe take a look at that. But overall, like, I haven't really encountered much issue. I've been having quite a good time. Uh, I've been struggling a little bit with the, uh, with the mage. I'm not gonna lie. Um, it's been, it's been a little hard to kind of get used to, because the, uh, the NPC pawns don't exactly do a lot of damage quickly like they should sometimes and so me being basically just support most of the time is a little difficult but it's fun i'm having a good time <clears throat> did you uh did you play the first one and we're kind of just interested in this game or do you plan on picking it up at some point uh, oh there's yep so, I think I'm just going here for, like, no reason, because I don't think I'm actually supposed to go up there to get into the town. I'm gonna drop this down, or I'm not. There we go. Now I'm gonna drop that down. What's in the box? Some dried meat. I'll take it. Dried meat and potatoes. go okay so i went over this i mean it wasn't for nothing i did get some uh let me see did that actually turn on some blur i just want to double check options graphics um uh, motion blur no it turned it's off i don't understand why there's a little bit of a blur lens distortions off subsurface scatterings off motion quality um probably just graphic stuff I don't know. It feels like it's a little boring. It might, might just be the, the like quality of stuff. Maybe that's probably what it is. Just watch stuff on the first one. I had to get the second one to try it out. Seems I'm going to be grabbing the first one too after playing this one. Yeah, so the first one was really good. Yeah, I really enjoyed the first one. So I actually streamed the first one before this one. Um, I wasn't able to get to everything because I, I, I originally played it a while back, but I never finished it. So I was like, okay, I definitely want to try to at least beat the game um, before the second one comes out. And I did at least achieve that goal. Um... But what ended up happening was I ended up getting through the first game and there's a certain quest in the first game that if you get yourself into it, it auto saves and it locks you into starting new game plus. Um, and so I accidentally did that and got locked into starting new game plus, which kind of sucks. Um, so I wasn't able to do some of the in game stuff that I wanted to in the first one. But uh, overall, not the biggest issue. Like I said, my main goal was mostly just to finish it, which I, I did achieve. So I got I got what I wanted out of it. Killing these creatures is the surest means to war against their foul spits. But now that one's also super fun. I mean, it still holds up pretty well considering it because it was originally made in like 2012, if I remember correctly, and then they did the Dark Arisen version. It was like 2016 or 2017, I think. So, definitely not bad considering. I enjoy tackling fierce. Kratos, I did not want to talk to you. So far, I'm finding that this one is significantly harder than the first one. So if you're like, I don't know how you're finding the game so far or how much you've played of this one. Um, but I feel like this one's more difficult so far. So um, if you are finding this one fine or not difficult, then the other one's probably going to be easier. This is kind of a point of reference. Yeah, we... <laughs> We actually have quite the party composition here. So I have Kratos over there, and I've got uh, my main pawn is actually Chester the Cheetah. So <laughs> we've got uh, we've got the God of War, and we've we've got Cheetos. So we've got we've got quite the party going on here. Rock, I don't actually know if he's from anything. Uh, I think he's just chilling. I can't I can't think of a point of reference that he would be from, but 
that's uh, that's the party composition we got going so far. We're having a great time with it. So. Okay. Um. This town. Did I did I walk all this way? I don't remember walking this way. And this is undiscovered, so I definitely didn't walk. Where where did I leave town at? I don't even remember. Okay. So there's supposed to be an entrance back there. I swear that was. Hmm. Well, we're gonna keep going this way anyways, but. That's that's who it could be, yeah, I guess. Yeah, I suppose I, I suppose I could see it. He's not as tall as you would think. So maybe. Man, I hate being heavy. This is terrible. My stamina is going awful right now. Yeah, no, he's he's not as tall as I would imagine somebody who somebody would make Dwayne the Rock Johnson, but I mean, hey. I I could definitely see the comparison. I didn't mean to keep spamming that. I was trying to heal, but that didn't end up working out. I'm trying to high five you, but I'm exhausted. Uh, I don't actually know what the button is. I'm sorry, Chester. Nope, that's not it. What's come over you, Arisen? Uh, nothing. We're chilling. Uh, uh, it's just, it's a hug instead of a high five. It's fine. It's fine. All the all the high fives and stuff like that uh, have been automatic, so I actually don't know what the button is. Still, grabbing a drink, heck yeah, get that drink, get the beverage. Uh, okay, we're not gonna be close enough. This should be close enough though. Shall we, make them their own impatience? we, we sure shall. Ooh, perfect. That might hit both of them. It sure will. Let's go. It's nice when they line up like that. Perfect when they line up like that, actually. Okay, so there's supposed to be an entrance to town up this way, yeah? It seems like. But, um, it looks like this is the bridge, but it's broken. I also did not definitely go this way at all. I don't know what this route is that I took, but we're going to get to town one way or the, one way or the other here. That That's going to happen. Are we going to be doing it the hard way? Probably. I'll wager I could make that shot. Strike true, lest the beast leave. Um, I think I found one of those. Did I eat that beetle already? I think I did, but I just want to double check those storage and stuff. Yes, I did. Okay. Good enough. Good enough. Is this... No, this is a whole different entrance to town. Yeah, so... Where, where was the other one that I missed? I don't even know... <laughs> I don't even know what entrance I ended up missing, but okay. I heard a rumor that this land was once a kingdom of beast I guess I'm just blind. Go figure, I suppose. I mean, now that I'm kind of like looking in this open-ish area, it doesn't... I don't, I don't know. I don't really see the blur anymore, I guess. Maybe I've just kind of adjusted to it, but... I don't really see it anymore, so... Whatever. Whatever. We cannot break it from this side. What are you trying to break? Rose? I gotta remember that I could just tap shift and it'll stop sprinting. Useful ingredients to be gathered here, old wager. We could nope. pick some. No useful ingredients. How dare you, Chester? When the need How dare you suggest that? Hey, my stamina is now good because we're in town. Let's go. Alright, so first things first, we need to hit the vocation thing. So that way I can actually change it up a bit, buy some new spells. We do. Be told, I was hoping we might. Would you care to stay and talk a moment? Hey, Novi, what you doing, Duggle? Sure. Are you going to pay me back? Probably not. I'm glad. But sit down, won't you? Sure, I'll pop a squat. I'm fond of this place. Hey, 
Absolutely chase the dragon. Absolutely. freaking lutely I never imagined a city could be like this. So full of excitement. So alive. And how could I have? In all my life, I've hardly left the palace. My mother is quite... Strict. I feel like this is all a rant for you to tell me that you're going to leave town and not pay me. Oft did I That's probably what's going to happen. Of normal life. Even aught as simple as going shopping for myself. My mother has always procured the things I covet for me, so to pick out an item and obtain it with my own hands held up. Which reminds me. Yeah, there I we go. That's, that's the again. conversation. Eh? I fear I cannot repay the full sum all at once. I have rather pray. Take this for now. My apologies, friend. But I'd best be. Thank you for indulging me. I, I do hope we'll. See How much should we get this time? Two hundred. Okay. Fair this enough. Is something I found. I wanted you to have it. What is that? I didn't get anything, so I don't know. I guess it gave me an invisible item or something. to sneeze one sec there we go we are back good tidings sir how fares your retrieval present weapons? yes thank you thank you oh, ho! you have procured an archer staff i see i sure have most excellent you may you have the most dumbfounded your look on your face <laughs> however if you wish to register as a warrior instead. I have both. Thank you very much. Good tidings, sir. How fares your retrieval of those plundered weapons? Very good, if I might say so myself. Marvelous. You have acquired both an archer staff and a great sword. You may now change your vocation as desired, sir. I don't really feel like this voice fits this guy, to What's be honest. More, I bear glad tidings. I feel like his voice should be a little different, but I dare say the armory will be resupplied and on. Nice, ooh, seventy-five hundred gold for that. Let's go. Have you business with the guild, sir? I should be glad to assist you. I sure do. Acquire and equip skills. Okay, so what do we got now? What is this? Fully and instantaneous recovers the health of the caster or a single ally. Does not recover the loss gauge. Okay. Uh, that's pretty good. The other one's great for like a party, but this one's pretty good because it's just all the health. So it's actually not bad. <clears throat> Levitate, I haven't really found too much of a use for at the moment. I mean, this isn't very good if I get the one because it's going to fully heal us anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Magic defense, I haven't needed that yet. So... I don't want to see how this... How does this look? Someone's giant pillar of ice? Hey, Zeros. Welcome. Welcome. How you doing? Yada gang. Love it. Critical made two more videos, and it's probably going to get eviscerated in reviews by people who don't own it. Did, like, was it, like, positive reviews, or was it, like, negative reviews? I haven't, I haven't really looked, if I'm being completely honest. Okay, we're going to try this, because ice seems kind of cool, so we're going to try that. Um, as much as I like this fire, it's also kind of a pain in the butt, so we're going to go with that. I don't have the option for high trigger yet. We'll see how useful it is, and then we'll kind of go from there, I guess. Okay, I do want this acquire... Yes. Yes, equip that. Do I have to pick a slot for it specifically? Because that kind of sucks if I do. I do. That sucks. So I could get both healing spells, but I have to trade off a spot for other things. That kind of sucks, okay? Not my favorite thing, but we'll we'll make it work. Haven't looked at the reviews, but he, can't, he straight up can't play it, so his personal review is overwhelmingly negative. Oof, that's not good. That's so strange. Like, I, I just haven't experienced any of that. <clears throat> like, I definitely got some uh, 
I definitely got some issues with some frame rates and stuff like that earlier, but I haven't had like a thing where I just actually can't play it, which is crazy. Mm. Can knock targets off balance, fires multiple rate of fire increases, prevents movement while active. Ooh, that seems really freaking good, dude. Okay, so we're definitely going to buy that for Chester. Absolutely equip that bad boy. I do think Exploding Shot could be pretty cool, too. We have Sweep Shot. Fires greater number of arrows. Oh, yeah, absolutely. That's that's going to be great for crowds. 100%. Oh, for sure. Yeah. <clears throat> no, that that's going to happen. I mean, that that's kind of the thing about having a big YouTube channel and stuff like that, is you kind of just have to be careful with what you say. Because your your unfortunately your word kind of carries a lot of weight. Jumping back after performing, ooh, that's that's pretty cool. Swift knock, knock arrows more quickly when losing, when using loose or steady shot. Puncture dart draws the bowstring. Difficult but allows arrows to pierce targets. Ooh, okay, what is this? By your attacks when targets are not in battle stance. Okay, so that's like a stealth thing. Increases maximum stamina. He absolutely needs that. Okay, so I think we should get some core skills as well. Swift knocking would probably be important, and this could be important as well. I don't feel like I've seen him use too much of this, but we're going to try it anyways. Okay, and then we could... Nah, I'm going to get this other augment just because we can afford it, and we might as well. Okay, and then I still have 2,000, so... I might as well grab this. Just because I don't have the reason to not at the moment. And then we can save up for some of the other stuff. I do want Levitate as well, because that can help me get some get some places that I probably wouldn't otherwise. Okay. <clears throat> this would be kind of nice as well, because this would be like a, a nice little buff for me personally. Which I, I would really need. Because I could probably get an upgraded version of this, which I think... Yeah, we can. Absolutely. Yeah, no, I, <clears throat> I think so. My, my whole thing about opinion, like about reviews is it's kind of hard because like, while I, I do agree that like people should be able to have their opinion. It's a little bit difficult because it's like. Reviews are so subjective that it's like. You can't re like you can't read all of the reviews because not everything that everyone reviews about a game is going to matter to you specifically. So for me personally, if I were to have it my way as far as reviews go, like the only reviews that would matter is like technical reviews and like how the game performs. Like is it is it technically well enough put together to where you could actually play the game with no issues or is there like game breaking stuff or like does it run like absolute garbage like those are the only things that like I would say I care about personally, but obviously, like I said, that's kind of a subjective thing and, and one thing that I would say personally for me, and that's not what everybody else would think, but that's that's what I would say as far as reviews, and that's probably the only thing that I would want to see in reviews. Just because having fun with a game is completely subjective. Like you have to play the game and you have to go into a game knowing you'll either like it or you won't. Um, and then, you know, kind of make your decision based off of you know, the gameplay and how you're actually liking, you know, the gameplay loop and things like that. So it's going to differ from person to person. So the reviews are semi irrelevant when it comes to the fun factor. Yeah, no, if they're, yeah, hundred percent zero. I agree. And that's what I'm saying is it's like a lot of these people looking at reviews are just, they're looking at reviews that probably don't matter to them is kind of the thing. Dude, I need that version so bad. Dude, I should have bought that earlier. F. That's going to help a ton. Because that'll, that'll make it so the party can't get hit multiple times. That's great, dude. That'd be so nice. Okay. That's what we're saving up for next is that right there. Because that'll help out a crap load. That's incredible. I also don't know what secret tokens do. What, is, what does this do? Uh, Yes, view rewards. Ah, okay. So you spend them and you get certain stuff. Okay. Oh, so we get a fairy stone for one seeker token. Likely to stagger and knock down foes. That's cool. Ooh, that's nice, man. The ring of triumph. I want that. 15 seeker tokens. Okay. 
Some armor. Ring of Profusion, that's nice. Champion's Mantle, Minx Tramp. Okay, I mean, that seems pretty kind of cool, but... Deepens the bond. Okay, so that's more of a romance thing. Drawing tightly over the waist and hips to a flattering effect. Interesting. Break out the deep grizzly biker voice. Stop putting on a facade. That's not your real voice. <laughs> so here's the thing. Like, um, the microphone that I have, it's not bad, but I haven't figured out like a great like sound setting for it. I've been messing around with it over the over the course of like my streaming stuff and and I haven't found like a really good sound that I like so I, I've been playing with it. I don't want to play with it too much to break it because then it just is going to sound like crap but that's kind of what I've been doing. Hey how's it going Buck? Yeah 24 hours. We're going to try. I'm I'm not guaranteeing anything here but that's that's the plan so. Ooh slightly boost discipline gain from freaking defeating foes that's kind of nice. I mean, up to a certain point, like once you've maxed out your vocations and stuff, yeah, not really a big issue, but. Is Foozles joining the Yetta gang? Foozles, Foozles has been a part of the Yetta gang. Priority quest set automatically, cool, okay. Change vocation, no, I don't need to do that. Do come again. I wouldn't know how to function for even 12 hours, let alone 24. So I've done 12 hour streams before um, and I, I can usually stay up pretty late so we're gonna try it I haven't I, granted I haven't done a 24 hour just in general like not streaming um, just a 24 hour in general in, in quite some time so we'll, we'll see if I end up making it I, I do have some energy drinks on deck so there is that but um, yeah welcome in Lindsay by the way how you doing hope you're having a great day so far uh, zeros, yes. The pawns are cross-platform. Yes, they are cross-platform. It's in the title. Your word is your bond. Absolutely. Yeah, I'm I'm going to hold up to that bond as much as I possibly can. I will absolutely give as much. I'll give 110%. That's, that's what I'll say. Even though that's not technically possible, we're going to do it. Yeah, absolutely. Add it. But also don't die. <laughs> yes. No, if we if we crash, we crash. It happens. It's going to happen. But we're going to go we're going to go as long as we can. Dr. Respect. <laughs> yes, Dr. Respect is here. Nah, it's it's Buck. He, he's got his own personality. He's the the very talented, uh, very talented instrument man, who's all about democracy. Okay, so I need to offload some stuff because we are not looking so hot on storage space. That's what we need to do. Chester is hanging out in there. He's lounging. Buck from Halo. He's Nathan Fillion. <laughs> That's fair. Well, you will soon forget the fatigue of a long journey. When Organize storage. No, I don't want to withdraw. I want to deposit. Thank you very much. There we are. Okay. I don't necessarily think I need a bunch of this stuff right now. I don't think this stuff ever goes bad, but it is kind of nice to have on deck for maybe whatever that I need it for. Um, I do need to sell this rotten stuff because it's not any good to me. And it's kind of just taking up weight. Like this is taking up like a whole kilogram by itself and it's it's literally not doing anything for me. So uh kind of need to do something about that. Let's see. What do you got, Chester? Got off earlier because I had a heavy storm rolling through. Didn't want the power to cut while auto saving or some other geese. Yeah, <laughs> no, that that would be terrible. So I will say um, that uh, occasionally I've had um, I've had some issues with like power and stuff like that. So um, if the stream does pop off um, at some point in time, um, just know that, that might be the the case. Well, it's not power necessarily. It's just like the Wi-Fi. It just decides to go out for like a split second. So if that does happen, I will be back. It's just. It, it's been happening, like, randomly. So if that does happen, um, just be aware. 
What's my in-game ID? I have no idea. On TikTok earlier, and a bit of Star Spangled Banner came up for the For You page. That's awesome. Heck yeah, Lindsay. That's what's up. Yeah, no, that that that's uh, that video has got quite a lot of traction. So I'm not I'm not really surprised. I am not surprised by that at all. It's got quite the uh, quite the viewership going on. Okay, so I think that's pretty much everything we can dump from him. In Actually, we have uh, Kratos has some stuff. Ogre Spurs. Cool. Good enough. And then we can sell that fruit. I don't know where we're going to sell that, but we're going to sell it somewhere. Or I guess just all the rotten stuff, not necessarily just the fruit. We have rotten meat, too. Let's go over here. I think we should be able to sell it pretty much anywhere. My entire For You page is basically Helldivers content. Yeah, that sounds about right. I mean, that's what happens when, you know, you like a game. That's what'll happen, you know. I don't even care that I'm not getting basically any money for this. I just don't want the weight. Yeah, see, that was so much weight and basically just rotten garbage. I couldn't even do anything with it. it was actually just taking up space. For democracy, absolutely. Oh, you found uh, you found the in-game ID. So if you check the prop, hope to see Wonder if there's a is there a way for me to check that? Nothing caught your eye. I found how to access your pawn ID. Oh, gotcha. Okay. Um, is it in is it in the menu somewhere, or do I have to go to the Rift thing? Status. Maybe. Uh, no. Pause, go to status, then your pawn, scroll over. Okay, so status. Uh, pawn. Pawn badges are awarded. Mark their accumulated knowledge. Okay. Monster badges who have defeated a certain number of particular type of monster. That's awesome. And who have camped a sufficient number of times in a particular region. Cool. Awesome, awesome. Okay, there is my pawn ID. Up. Oh, accidentally hit right-click. Sorry. Hold on. Let me actually type that in chat, so that way, if anybody wants to add Mr. Chester here, you can. Hold on. Is that a zero? I think that's a zero. H zero? Okay, that should be right. There we go. Pin. Manually unpin at the end of stream. Yes. There we go. Mr. Chester looks ravishing. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. I I tried to make him as best as I could. The hair the hair was really the thing that uh was throwing me off on Chester, honestly. Because there's not a lot of good hairstyles that really like represent like a spike kind of thing. So I kinda had to just do what I could. And I, d I didn't want to make him bald because he has like an oval shaped head. So the hair makes it look less like a freaking oval. So. Chester, what are you doing over there, dude? Can you come here? You're sl are you stuck? Who are you there? Your presence is requested at the. Okay. Chester, what are you doing in here, dude? You slacker? Trying to get some freebie drinks. Binging Dragon's Dogma 2 since yesterday. Me need to dabble. <laughs> Lindsay, yeah, absolutely. You know, it's fun. It's uh, it's absolutely fun. Unable to find pawn. I got wrecked. Okay, hold on. Let me let me double check that I didn't screw it up. Because that's a possibility. Okay, so RJ S Y A Q T. 3-G-G-H-O. Hey, what's good, Buck? What the sub? Thank you so much for that, man. I appreciate that. I do appreciate that, my friend. Okay. So the pawn ID is correct. 
At least it looks like it. It should be cross-platform. It said it was cross-platform. Um, they did say that it was, or that it should be. So, hold on. Let's do a quick goggles here. Um, dogma. How to find cross-platform pawn. Let's see. Let's see. So it seems like there's some kind of confusion with possibly like uh maybe it being like official pawns and stuff like that. Hmm. Okay. So I'm not 100% sure. I'm not 100% sure. Let me see if I can Yeah, let me see if I can use your code. Let me go to the Rift thing again real fast. What's my favorite aspect of Dragon's Dogma 2 compared to Dark Arisen? Um, I think honestly the the visual overhaul and the fact that the the AI seems to be a bit better. It's still not perfect, and there's still definitely some derpy things about it. Um, but I think those are probably the two that stand out the most to me. Is the uh, a lot of the graphics and like design choices and stuff are really cool. Hoping to use Chester and get some Cheetos. <laughs> he always he always carries a bag on him. He's wheeling and dealing in some hot Cheetos or some regular Cheetos, if that's what you're into. No judgment here. Okay, so search for a pawn. Search by pawn ID. Okay. So NX5. Is that a zero? Or is that a Q? Or an L? No, it's not a Q. Is that an L? We'll try L first. If that doesn't work, we'll see. S523. XRUP. Okay, search. Confirm. I have to hit that enter for some reason. Unable to find pawn and just search conditions. Okay, let's try zero. N X five zero S five twenty three X R U P. Boop. Nope. Unable to find pawn and just search conditions. Okay, so yeah. So we tried both, and it doesn't seem like it's working. Hmm. Interesting. So they... I thought they said that it was going to be cross-platform, though. I'm, I'm pretty sure that they said that it was going to. That's kind of whack. It is absolutely easy being cheesy. Melina? I guess that does... I mean, she has a wolf cowl thing on, so I guess maybe... Who is this guy? Wow, he is very awkwardly proportioned. Grunkle? Who the hell's Grunkle? That's funny. Yeah, maybe not yet. I don't know. Like, I could have sworn they said it was going to be here, like, on launch, but I I don't know. This That's room interesting. Has been troubling me ever since I first caught wind of it. That is very interesting. Apparently, there is an illness we pawns can catch beyond the rift. The okay, so I need to hit an in. ourselves and others. It's absolutely medieval time. Absolutely. I need to go upstairs because that's where the inn actually is. Not down here. Needed some Cheetos, man. I feel you. I feel you. That is sad. I, I hope that that's like just like an update thing. Like it's going to come. Because that I, I'm pretty sure I'm almost 100% certain they said that it was going to be in the game. So that would kind of suck if it didn't end up in there. At least people on PC can add Chester now. Yeah, for sure. Um, maybe I'll have to adjust the message, because, yeah. Or, I'll just address it, I guess, as it comes up, really. If, if it becomes too much of a need, I'll just, I guess, mess it. Or mess with it, but right now it's probably fine. We got a ring. Slightly boost max health. Why do we have two of these, by the way? 
Oh, it reduces damage from fire attacks. That's kind of nice. Wait, wasn't there a ring that I could buy somewhere? I know I could buy a ring from the pawn stuff, but wasn't there a ring, like the armory I could buy? Because we have some monies. Yeah, it, that is kind of sad, though. I, I'm pretty sure they said that it would be cross-platform, but I guess uh, I guess not. If only so far. At least Welcome at the moment. Is what you need if you want to oh, we need some quality, all right. Okay, so this is... Yes, this is what I want. That was really expensive, and that's why I never bought it. But I'm definitely going to buy it because I can't stand the current weight problem that they're dealing with constantly. It's so actually a problem. Okay, so I don't have this upgraded. Should I? I kind of want to see if there's anything else I could buy as far as armor goes, because, yeah, I'm not really a fan of the way I'm looking right now. Also, why is that so blurry? What's the deal with that? Why are they so blurry? That's weird. And the storm is back full force? Oh, no. Want to find out where to get it? Yeah, I don't know. A lot of people are finding some crazy stuff already, which is interesting. Okay, well, we're just apparently blurry for some reason. I don't know why, but we are. Uh, That's slightly worse, but it might be worth it. I don't... I mean, I do have the money for it. Let's see. Let's go into chess pieces. What do we got? Tribal brace. That's better than regular defense, which I might honestly do, because I'm kind of getting slapped around a lot. I'm also not really a big fan of this, like, massive shawl we got going on. It's way too expensive. Blurry yet again? Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know what was going on there. I don't know. Many thanks. I appreciate the business. Gonna do the sleep. Stoked to get a proper night's sleep for sure. Yeah, sounds good, Buck. We'll catch you later, man. Um, I'm sure if you have time, I'll see you. Uh, I'll, oh, I'll see you at some point tomorrow. But you do get yourself some normal sleep. Is that a freaking... Is that like an in-game setting? That makes it blurry like that? No, it seems fine. Was it just the fact that I was like near a fire or something? That's weird. Huh. Okay. F if I know. Are there like transmogs for cosmetics? Um, I don't know yet. I don't think so. They're not really the one to kind of do those kind of things with this game. So my answer would be highly doubt it, but I'm, I am I can't say 100% for certain. But again, like I said, my my initial thought would be probably not. Okay, so that's decently better. Can't afford it, though. I could afford this. Is it just that I'm near like a fire or something? Like what? What's what's the deal with this? Is it blurry? I guess it is like a fire, like maybe blurring the background. Maybe it's just it's so strange. I don't know. I guess we'll just have to ignore it. I don't know if that's a issue or if it's the settings that I messed with or something, but it's just blurry now. So I guess we'll just have to deal with that. Looks like there's a chest up there. Is it up there? Or is it on the building? Doesn't seem like I could get up there unless there's some magical way of flying. Okay, we'll try to get in the house then. Maybe. No, no way to get into the house. Okay. What are you selling? Well met. Looking to make a pet? Sure am. Reduces damage taken from slash attacks. Okay. It's kind of nice. Otherwise, you don't really have a lot. So. Yes. Like how the shawl is on a constant state of being in a wind tunnel <laughs> on the receiving end of an absurd amount of starch. <laughs> Glad to see you again. Yeah, no, it's uh, it's kind of funny. It's flapping about. Sticking up from when you see it from the side. Ingredients yeah, no, it's like it's like floating. We collect as much as we can carry. It looks much bulkier than it needs to. Like 
all the time. I'm kind of I'm kind of over it to be completely honest with you. What is it actually providing? 60 de 63 defense and 113 magic defense. Okay, well, it's providing a decent amount of stats, so I kind of don't want to unequip it, but it also looks bad. I'm sure we'll find something later that's not so terrible. All right, all right. Okay, what what quests do we have? I haven't checked in a second. So visit the star drop in a night and confer with Captain Brant. Okay. Receive recompense from Sven in a few days' time. I did that. Watch the beggar as he goes about his day and see if he can't find out how he makes his coin. I guess we could try to make that a thing. We could try to mess with that and see what's going on there. Try to mess around with that. Fashion police will get you first before the scummy animals. <laughs> yeah, no, 100%. I'm going to get myself first because it looks like crap. That's what I'm going to get. Now, listen close. As today, I shall speak of riddles and monsters with frightful mysteries. How long do we have to wait here and sit? In the north of Vermont is our curious tale staged, where ventured a hero off left. This ladder can take us to new heights. Are wow. you arisen? Very observant of you that a ladder would take you upwards, Chester. A solid conclusion, my friend. Unto him a demand was made. And who the asker? Why, the beast! An uncanny Do we just have to sit here? Does he go somewhere at some point? Yet there was no time for shock and dismay. As answer my riddle, did the fearsome thing say? The trickery was clear. To respond meant certain doom. But in the midst of his answer, he'd doubtless be consumed. So a mighty attack did our hero dispense to conquer his foe and banish it thence. Okay. You've got quite the story going on here. Oh, 100%. I'm going to take... Hold on. I'm going to take a look at uh, one of these things real quick. Nope. If you could go into options, that'd be incredible. So, I messed with this and turned this on, but I don't exactly know what that changed here. Auto. So, ultra performance goes to 4.66. Off is 4.92. I don't know what auto does. What does that exactly do? Texture filtering? Yeah, I don't exactly know what that's changing. Ew, yeah, no. No, yeah, they're terrible. They're awful. I hate it. Max is let's let's try maybe max no, we'll, we'll keep it at twenty or one twenty, because we, we should be able to do that. Obviously it's not gonna hit that, but the more the merrier, right? Mortal strength it beheld. Such is the legacy. No, it doesn't look as blurry. So I guess maybe we fix it. I don't know. Hey anomaly, how's it going? How you doing? Okay, I think we've watched enough of this guy, maybe. Should my tale entertain you? Nay, even if it shouldn't, I would greatly appreciate a coin or two to soothe my throat. The dude on left on ground. Yeah, Kratos is just chilling because he's sick of hearing this guy. As today, I shall speak of riddles and monsters with frightful mystique. Look like your VTube character? VTube. I don't have VTube. Where ventured a hero off left. Hey, how's it going, Brother Scrib? How you doing? How we doing? Into a temple of baleful feature. Only to be confronted. Okay, well, I I don't exactly know what the deal is with that guy, but I don't want to sit here forever looking at him, so we're not. Um, what else do we have to do? 
It's not that's not important enough for me to sit there that long. Yeah, he's going about his day terribly slow. Okay, so we need to we need to set this as priority and go to the tavern at night. So we do need to rest until nighttime, which sure. Let us indeed do well that. You are come to good, your late Sag. Yeah, it's all good though. We haven't. If I'm being honest, we really haven't done much. So. So you're not missing out on too much. We're only two hours. I mean, two hours is a decent amount of time, but we haven't we haven't done a ton of quests. Most of it's just been kind of dinking around. Step lively. Journey by starlight shall make for a nice change of pace. Shall we get underway? Shall we indeed? We should go to the tavern, because we need to. Which was down here. Boop. Can I get in through this way? Sure can. Oh. All right, let's talk to this guy. Twenty-four hour stream. Yes, that is that is the idea. To call for you. Tis not a matter for prying ears. Pray. Okay, where are we going? Where are we going? Where there's no prying ears. I guess just slightly outside. As I informed you when last we spoke, the palace is filled with the Queen Regent's sycophants. Two ogres and a griffin almost killed the griffin before it flew away. Oof. Man, griffins are the worst. They fly away so fast. Few would elect to doubt her. Yet if we are to prove your identity, I believe there is no occasion more suitable than the coronation. Coronation, huh? It was delayed so that the sovereign, that is, the false arisen, could convalesce in the palace. But the date has now been set. The central players in the court ought all be in attendance. It would be a fine opportunity to display your ma- None would be able to deny that you are the true arisen then. There is a problem, however. Only select members of the nobility and citizens. They destroy ox carts? Yeah, no. Griffins are the worst. Prosperity. They run away and then they just inconvenience you. <laughs> They're like an inconvenience bandit. They'll steal your time, they'll steal your ox carts and dip. If your majesty is to be counted among them, you will need to attend to a number of tasks. Pray, allow me to summarize them for you. Sure. The citizenry have called upon... Killed both ogres, almost got the griffin. The griffin kill would have been a new milestone. I did yeah, say, I mean, I could probably get one too. Like, if I had some good fire, I probably could get one, but it's just, it's such a pain because they just run away so far. In this matter. You sure can. I thank you, your majesty. The first is Trevo Mine, to the northwest. Next okay. is Half Village, west of Burnworth. Okay. And finally, there is a call for someone to locate a group of soldiers tasked with delivering freight. Easy peasy. There is much we ought to tend to. Tell me the we Queen Regent. To the palace to gather evidence of Deezer's misdeeds. I have attempted to do the same through my own channels before now. Would that I could undertake the task myself. But my station, what say you, your majesty? Sure. I shall ensure that the door to the Queen Regent's office is open between midnight and dawn. Okay, so I do have to be careful about just accepting quests, though, because if one of these is timed, I kind of have to do it at the right time. So I guess I won't accept that last one just to be safe, because I don't want to accidentally goof it up and just in case it's timed. When you knock them over, they stay down for a long time. If I had a third fighter, we could have killed it. We were just wailing on its head for a solid minute. Yeah, no, their head is really, really weak. You can really slap the heck out of it. Okay, so what is what what what's the deal with this circle? What, what priority quest do we have here? Ornament box. Receive recompense from Sven. Okay, so no. Does, has this changed at all? Because maybe it has now that it's nighttime. No. It's a ladder. Should we see where it leads? That didn't change. And I have no idea where it is, so I'm not going to go on for him. If we don't get to it, we don't get to it. Slip into the palace through the rear gate between the hours of midnight and dawn and search the Queen Regent's office for incriminating evidence. Sure, we'll do that. Because we're here, so we might as well. Perhaps new discoveries time stuff would be a killer for me. Yeah, no, there there is time stuff that's available. So if you don't do stuff within a certain time range... um. 
it's failed. But you don't have to accept it right away. So like accepting one quest at a time, if you're worried about failing a timed quest, is probably the best way to handle it because you could just do one at a time. Because like if you don't accept it, the timer doesn't start. But you do have to be careful with progressing the main story because certain things do get locked out. So if you progress the main story too far, I believe you'll get locked out of certain things as well. So that's kind of a little bit of a teeter-totter. Hey, how's it going, Obi Wanks? How you doing? I am doing great. Chilling and petting the cat. That's what's up. Stealth missions kick your butt. I'm terrible at stealth missions. Not because I can't do stealth, but because I don't have patience for stealth. So, I mean, like, I can I can do stealth for a very short amount of time, and then I'm just over it. And then I lose my patience, and I'm like, okay, I don't want to stealth anymore. And then I always usually screw it up. So, yeah. That's, that's typically how stealth missions go for me. Okay, so... How do we get into the back? Does that work exactly? Do we have to go... Is there like a secondary entrance somewhere? Not exactly certain. Okay, so let's go to map for this then. Okay, so it says it's there, but how are we supposed to get there? There's a gate, apparently. But I haven't seen such a gate. And this is also kind of on an island. So I guess we'll head this way and see if there's another section, maybe, around the other way. Did you talk to Mildred yet? No, I have not. I don't know who that is. I don't think. I might have. But it doesn't sound familiar to me. It's my mindset. I want to hungabunga. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, civilian dies, their body will be brought to the mortuary. In three days they're passing, whether the corpse ends up in morgue or Roman's journal house. Depends on where it was found. The Arisen can revive the dead so long as they have access to the corpse. Okay. So you can just go around resurrecting dead people. Cool. There's not consequences to that, I'm sure, at all. Is there a giant hole? That seems dangerous. Is that an item I could grab? Sure is. Here's a surprise. I loot this coffin. Of discovery never gets I feel like if I were to like mess with this, I feel I like to remember to tell my own master about this. I feel like he would get mad at me, so I'm probably not gonna do that. So I don't wanna go to jail. Okay, so let's take a look at that map again. It doesn't look like this is the way to go either. Maybe there's a way around the cliff back there, maybe. She has a quest where she has to stay at her house while she travels abroad for a week. It's a free place to stay in town. Hmm. I have not done that. No, I don't think I've encountered Mildred. Ooh, that is quite the fall. Okay, so not that way. We need to go through the town to get over there. Otherwise, we're going to be breaking some ankles. And that is not the preferred method at the moment. I could tell you how to find her if you want. Yeah, we can definitely take a look after we're done with this. I want to I wanna do this real quick, and then we can figure out Mildred for sure. Is this a diviner's salon? Greetings. You need only make a worthy offering in exchange. Pay fee, sure. I have seen your path. May these words guide you true. Venture to Vernon with Castle Office is the next milestone on thy path. Okay. You've my gratitude. Tis lovely to see you. Was that worth the 50 gold? I don't know. We'll find out, I guess. Maybe. Maybe we won't. Sharpest ears, huh? Put a grindstone to him, huh? What is this guy doing here? Do you know? What are these guys doing just hanging out down here? Let's deal with these guys. Have no fit. Yeah, master. I'll fare all right without you for a little while. Okay, so this is the jail tower. It is not our place to hurry the arisen. So clearly that's not the back gate. Where the hell is the back gate? It says I can go this way, but Clearly not. That's a whole cliff. There's no way I'm making it up there. No. 50 gold for advice. The advice water is wet. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Yeah, that's that's about right. That's accurate. All 
Alright, so that's clearly not the way. Why, why am I walking one step at a time? Come on now. That's not the way we do stairs. We hop stairs, my friend. Slacking. Okay, so is it like outside of the town then? Uh, when you enter the town from the main gate, run towards the stairs that lead to the fountain. Stop at the bottom and turn left. Run up those through the archway. Find two archway. Okay. I'll have to get there and, and read those because I will 100% forget all that. A treasure chest. Shall we see if we can't make our way over to it? No, we shall not. Not your current quest, yeah. So, it like, there's no way to get, like, in the back, though, from what I'm looking at on the map here. This is just a whole island. So how the, how the heck am I supposed to get over there? What kind of secret shenanigans are we withholding here? Do I just walk through this section? So, my quest right now is to search for evidence of Deesa's misdeeds, and I have to slip in through the palace through the rear gate between the hours of midnight and dawn, which it's pretty dark right now, so I'm assuming it's generally within those hours. Haven't done that one yet? Yeah, so your, your guess is as good as mine then at this point. I have no clue how to do this. Mayhap this ladder is here for a reason. After you were risen. Um. I guess we could just try to go through the main gate. I mean, we'll probably end up in jail, though. So, that, that might be a thing that happens. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. We're going to try it anyways. Pick some now. And use them when the need arises. It seems we must part. You are the arisen. Yes. Ah, okay. The cat. Follow me. So that was that was the answer. Okay. Good to know. It was a little misleading telling me to go through the back entrance, even though this is absolutely the front entrance. But uh, sure. Little trial and error, and we got there. And we didn't end up in jail, so there's that. Yet, that is still definitely within the realm of possibility at the moment. We done here? Or we... It is best you move along. Should one of the other go pray, be cautious. Okay, is this the back door? Guardhouse. Okay, seems like it. Maybe. Marcher's helm. Ooh, marcher outfit. Nice. I'll take a free outfit. Okay, I should probably turn my lantern off. Um, I don't know if that decreases or increases visibility, but we might as well decrease our chance if possible. Writings of a soldier on duty. Ones used to loiter about the rifts down in droves, but I haven't seen a single one for some time now. Where they might have gone, wonder if this bear is Nope. Okay, so I don't need to go here. I just need to be over here. You don't have to be stealthy around the guards on the palace grounds. I thought you did, but they, you're told to look the other way. Okay. I'll trust your advice. But jail time might be possible. Any lootables? Nope. I understand, like, the realism of going upstairs, but this is awful. Now doing your quest. There we go. A reaper with the lethal company air horn. Okay, well, we have proven the point that they don't arrest you. 
What is this? Torn letter. What goodies does this have, I wonder? Oh, Sven? What are you doing? Ah, well, I mean, <laughs> they they uh they don't seem to care in here either, so. Pray, keep your voice low. Wouldn't be good for either of us if someone was summoned to come check on me. Check on you? Why would you be checked on? Could it be that you have come to bring Mother's schemes to light? Ah, oh, so you're the son. Uh, gotcha. Lisa is my mother. Pray forgive me for not telling you soon. So it was a good thing that we gave him that loan, huh? It was never my intent to deceive you. I simply feared that if I spoke the truth, none would wish to involve themselves. Interesting. So we did make the right decision here. That is no longer a concern. It is clear that we are allied in purpose. Maybe. He could also be playing word. You mean to the part that here. You are the true arisen. That the sovereign currently residing in the palace is a pretender. Balthazar Brant, whatever is the captain, so you pretty much told the other guards to leave you alone. Gotcha. Could mother have had a hand in that as well? Regent Kin Sven appears to be missing from his chambers. Oof. Joel? This isn't Helldivers. Get out of here, Game Master Joel. Me? No, sir. Then start searching, you fool. Should aught befall the Regent Kin, tis us who'll answer to her grace. Forgive me. My absence seems to have made this rather more difficult for us. You ought leave the palace at once. This room turned up little of interest. But I've a mind to look into this further. I shall set- I'll head out first and speak with the Sentinels. Use- Will do. Is there any goodies in here? Oh, I can just use the window, huh? Okay. Uh, is there anything to loot in here, though, is the real question. Hmm. Ooh, nice. Some good old stealth. Perfect. In and out like that, eh? Let's get back out of here. Out we go. Oh my god. What? What's that? Something happened. Something big. Okay, so we got that done. So now I don't have to worry about that. There's the rest of my party. Hello, Mooney. How are you, Husko? What you doing? What you doing, Duggo? The marcher's armor is what you've been looking for? Ooh, nice. Actually, I forgot that I grabbed that. Let's check it out. Is it any is it any good? So I actually already had this helm. Um And it's all worse than my stuff, unfortunately. It's kind of a bummer, but what is he wearing? 82 and 93. Okay, so every so you could just honestly sell this. I, I do like the look of it, but the stats are kind of garbo. Yeah. The the stats are decent, but they're not as good as what I need them to be, so. I'm probably not gonna wear it. Back to the tavern we go. Ooh, good thing we landed on that, otherwise we would have gone crisplat. Can I can I get in here? There's a bucket blocking the door, seriously? Is that really what's happening right now? Can I, or is it, is that just actually blocked the whole time? Or am I just an idiot? Maybe that's blocked the whole time. I could have sworn I've gone in that door before. Guess not. Now there's a worthy prize. More of an appearance thing, I'm sure end game it could be good. Yeah, I'm sure it's not bad. I'll, I'll probably stash it. I don't think I'm gonna sell it. I'll probably stash it though. Okay, what exactly am I waiting here for? Okay, report back to Captain Brant. Oh, there he is. Okay. There is much we ought to tend. If it's else for next to nothing, you could always store infinite storage and never know. If it's, yeah, that's that was kind of the plan. That was always the plan. Um. How fared your mission? Was there aught suspicious to be found in the Queen Regent's office? Just a torn letter. Scrap. It was part of a letter, and from Batal, no less. Batal, indeed. This alone can prove little, but it is clear that these schemes run deep. Doing some stealth. 
Deza's actions have weighed even on the mind of her own son. Tis a surprise, but a welcome one. Deza is a, the doting mother before the Regent King. If Regent King Sven is willing to aid us by drawing Deza's focus, we may be able to gain here more useful information. You have done well, Your Majesty. Though I am limited in the aid I make. Hey, 1200 XP. Absolutely. And 6500 gold. That's great. We could definitely have used the money. be working in concert with this Phasus fellow. What precisely is the Okay, so now we need to go back to day because I'm not particularly looking to run out and do anything at night because nighttime sucks. So we're not going to do that. Contend with your pursuer. There's a pursuer? That's right. That's not good. I don't know about that. There's flowers here. Sure, I'll take a bunch of flowers. I don't know how useful that's going to be, but sure. I'll take that. What's, what's this? Salmon, driver's daybook. Yeah. Probably nothing terribly important. What should be like the most important quest in the game? You will soon forget the fatigue of a long journey. Doubt it. To the foremost. Okay, deposit. We don't need this. I actually already have another one of those helms in my thing, anyhow. So I don't know why I was keeping that other thing on me. It's fine. So we have two wake stones. Those weigh point three freaking kilograms. Holy. Kind of heavy. It deepens the bond between giver and receiver. Okay, so I still haven't found anybody to like do any sort of romance stuff we've been with. So. Alright, we've got that settled. We rested and we're good to go. Can I just talk to him and see what the heck's the deal? Got some coin to spare your humble. Deliver a hundred gold, sure. It's much appreciated. If it seems to maybe progress this quest. Here's a ladder. Shall we see where it leads? We ought to put it to good use. I got some coin to. Okay, he just what takes money. Me? I'll have no trouble, thank. Okay, so offering gold didn't seem to really hasten anything there. Also, where's Sven? I think uh, I think that's who was supposed to be this quest. Yeah, there he is. Hi, you got the money. Would you care to join me? I'd not say no to a bit of company. I was hoping you'd say that. Do you know I had a feeling we'd meet here today? Intuition, I suppose. Well, you're kind of in the center of town, so it's you know. It's a little, uh, it's a little reasonable to think that we might Say, bump into each other. You're not from round here, are you? I did not find my pursuer, no. Have you seen many places? I just randomly got the quest, and I don't know what it is. How I envy you. I long to learn more of the outside world, but she's always telling me how dangerous it is beyond the palace walls. But... That only makes me question her judgment. Hello, good sir. What's she doing there? After all, if the world truly is so perilous, what of the lives of our people? They must be fraught with uncertainty. It seems unfair that I alone should be shielded from that reality. But listen to me waffling on. <laughs> waffling, I, that's a term. I almost forgot. That's definitely a term. I, my apologies, friend. But I'd best be going. Thank you for indulging me. I, I do hope... So here's the deal. Like, I know that you're a part of the princess stuff, so you should have a little bit more money than that, but it's, it's fine. Had the quest for ages. Let me take a look at that, because I kind of got it randomly. Make contact with the mysterious figure who's been shadowing you your every step. So there was a similar quest in... Uh, there was a similar quest in the first one that said just to, like, watch out at night. And I tried triggering it. And I couldn't, I couldn't seem to get it to do anything. Reaper with the emotes, absolutely. 
But yeah, no, I, I couldn't seem to ever get it to trigger, so I'm, I'm assuming that's probably going to be the same thing here. I'm probably just never going to get this to trigger. That'll probably be the case. Surprise, motherfucker. Surprise indeed. Absolutely surprise. Yeah, I don't I don't know who my pursuer would be exactly. Quests. Oh, it's still on this, I see. What if I can I put it as the main quest? Does it update any locations? No, it doesn't. Okay, so yeah, it's it's one of those things where it's just you have to kinda of wait for it. And I yeah. No. If I never get it done, I never get it done. If it happens, it happens, but I'm not gonna go seeking it out. Because there's just not enough information to be running about looking for nothing, basically. So I'm, I'm not going to bother with it. All right, let's take a look at the map. So there's a bunch of the regions over here. And then there's this region over here that we've already kind of explored. Ish, give or take. So I say maybe we go here. But then we come back, hit town, come this way, hit this way. And then go from there, I think. That's probably the best way to do it. There's no ox cart that way, so. We're just gonna have to leg it. Levitate! Oh, nice. <laughs> That's awesome that they can catch you. That's great. I was totally willing to take the fall damage, but I'll take a I'll take a recovery. Don't mind if I do. As a matter of fact, mm, as a matter of fact, huh? you to carry the burdens we cannot. I must thank you. Your toil keeps me light on my feet. It certainly isn't easy work. But I am proud to be captured. Of you. So I need that because, yeah. Can I do additional ice? No, I can't do additional ice. <laughs> when Guardian Levy was seeing his enemies, yeah. Something like that. Argent Tonic? What does this do? Oh, this is the heal. That's right. High 11. Perfect. As Swish and flick the shit out of your wand? Yeah. 100%. That's the way to do it. That's the way to do things. So, so far, ice seems like Garbo. At least against wolves. There's that. Damn Griffin. Okay, we need Palladium because I don't want to get slapped. Yeah, wolves, yeah. I mean, a bunch of stuff really hates fire, but the thing about it is, is I wanted to try out ice just to see how decent it was, and kind of seems like it just sucks for wolves, which makes sense, but I I'm going to try it out on some other stuff. Sorry, Insight Ice, that makes sense. I know griffins also hate fire. Which would be great for this guy, but the problem is, is I don't really have... A lot of choice in the matter. Rock, there you go. There's a heal for you, buddy. Res Kratos. I am right Gonna pop down this heal. Blueberry down. <laughs> yeah. Also, I'm not really doing a lot of damage, which kind of sucks because. The, uh, the lightning doesn't seem to be doing much on this guy. And I don't currently have fire at the moment. It sucks so far that you can only have, like, four skills, because you used to be able to have, like, eight when it came to the mage. Well, technically eight. You could have, like, the upper skills or whatever. 
like the high tiers. At least that's what I remember. It might not be actually that way, but. Can you stop coming off the ground, man? You had six, was it six? Okay. Yeah, I didn't play Sorcerer most recently. The, the last time I played Sorcerer was a while ago, so. The information definitely may not be accurate. Okay, yeah, there goes the Griffin, when enraged, which is good. Is capable of calamitous strength. We okay, ought not well, to provoke it. It didn't enrage, so there we go. Yeah, I don't even know where you found the dragon zeros. That's crazy. Also, we're wearing the hat, so. For them being supposedly weak to ice, that didn't seem to do a lot of damage. I'm gonna be honest. I'm just gonna be honest. The animation for that's really cool, but. If we mastered that attack, we would be invincible. Mm, that's debatable. It's a dragon from eBay. <laughs> you got the dragon from Wish. Seems legit. And there's a red dragon that bobbles all over it that it, I have to pop. Oof. The real question is, are you able to deal with said dragon? This creature is hard as stone, making an idea of other You're probably much more equipped to deal with the dragon than I am, but yeah. Let me. There we go. The creature's corpse will serve us well. Yeah, so wear this for about 30 minutes, since you did redeem that. Oh, gotcha. That makes sense, then. Oh, there's bandits, huh? The enemy retreats. Okay, that's not what I was really attempting to do, but... I need to pump this. and I shall strike them down. Miss, and you shame us both. That's actually not what I wanted to do. I wanted to do Palladium, not that, but whatever. Kind of look the same. That also has a really long travel time, that ice attack, so I don't really know how useful that is to me at the moment. I might just trade that out. Kind of seems like it sucks right now. Yeah. Not a fan so far. It didn't seem to do much against uh, Saurians either, so no idea. Interesting. All right. Well, I suppose we could just make camp and then change it up because, yeah, I actually don't have to change it up um, with a camp. I can just do it from here, which is great. So we're going to change this out because this kind of sucks. Palladium's definitely really nice. Argentonic, I'm not terribly, like, convinced on at the moment. Do you want celerity as well? Hmm. Should have bought a high version of that. That would have been useful. I just hate that the NPCs have to come to me to get the healing. Um, that's why I was kind of thinking Argent Tonic would be pretty decent, because then I could just throw a heal to somebody and not have to make them run back to me, because then that kind of makes aggro come back to me as well. So... Mm, I think we'll run with this for now. We don't really need to make camp. Oh, jeez. Weren't supposed to kill it. The dragon was a scripted story event. Gotcha. I like and hate that at the same time. Because it's like, you want to take it down, but obviously you can't. Because it's scripted not to be able to. So that kind of sucks. But it's like it almost kind of feels like you're putting in work for no reason. I mean, obviously you're kind of progressing the story with it, but you can't really get the loot, which is the crappy part. I think we can make this with the levitate. There's a cyclops over there. But the thing about it is I worry that my team won't be able to make it over there with me. So that's kind of the problem. I don't know how they would get over the river. Let's see. Map. 
So the, okay, so there's a path if I go back and then I go over this and across that way, we should be able to get there as well. I've learned the Meister's teaching now. Oh my god, want to be one Miata? <laughs> Just get a new team. I would. But, um, it's not exactly how it works, unfortunately. Also, 1v1ing <laughs> anything, anything, literally, outside of the mage class is just going to end in a disaster for me. So, I don't even, I don't even have to duel you to say that I'll probably lose. There's like a 99% chance of that. And that's, that's... Assuming that there even was PvP in this game. Staying Griffin, man. You keep coming around, teasing with the fact that you might do something, and then you leave. Get out of here, man. Stop that. Yeah, you literally just slammed and dipped. Uh, this game is 70. I think it's 80 if you buy the deluxe edition. He's coming in hot. Did you... Dude, are you serious? I see you've been drenched. He Try fell it. into the river. <laughs> He killed himself. I got a griffin for free because he rammed himself into the river. <laughs> That's great. That's awesome. I'll take it. Easy dub. That's doing a whole bunch of jack crap. That's terrible. Oh, the griffin wanted a drink real quick. He was parched. He was absolutely parched. Needed some extra needed some extra water in his life, I guess. Oh, I'm out of freaking stamina. Oof. Ow, ow, chill out. Heal up, my friend. It went to talk to its ancestors. You mean the ones that have never died because they always run away? Griffins are literally the worst because of that. <laughs> it's awful. The thing about it was since it took a, a nice toasty dip in the water, I didn't get any of its loot. So I got the XP and stuff, but I didn't keep the loot, which kind of sucks. So we'll definitely have to kill another one later, but it's fine. All life came from the ocean. There you go. That's fair. Back sleeping with the fishes. Well, at least he pissed off for now. He'll, he'll be back, though. I can almost guarantee it. He'll respawn. And become an even bigger pain in the butt. I don't see any parts of this guy that's armored. Oh, but I guess his legs and stuff are weak points anyways. Okay. Yeah, his legs and arms seem to be weak points regardless. I thought it was just because of maybe the armor that he was wearing that might have made that the case, but... Guess not. His legs just seem to be a weak point, which is great. Let's heal you. Get Kratos with that one. Heal him. Nice. All right, Rock is gonna need some uh, some healing. Nope. Oh, there we go. There we go. Targeting's a little weird. It kind of jumps around a bit. Pretty sure it came from a station somewhere. 
That adds up. I can see it. Come on, stumble, dang it. I need this goblin to go away, even if I get slapped. Ouch. Okay, that hurt a lot. Ow, okay. I wasn't really able to do anything. That's terrible. Alright, we'll just use two of those, I guess. Stop being all dead <laughs> when reviving a blueberry, yeah. Absolutely. One hundred percent. A thirsty griffin be dripping. <laughs> there you go. Heck yeah. All right, can you like burn? That'd be incredible. Thank you, much appreciated. I got you, Chester. Don't worry. I got you. I got you, Rock. I got you again, Chester, maybe. I wish that did like a group healing. That'd be nice. Eight hobgoblins attacking me at the same time. <laughs> Literally stun locked. Yeah, no, that's, yeah, big oof. That sounds like a bad time. I need to use palladium is what I need to do, so that way I can have a shield. I keep forgetting about that, but it's incredibly useful. One health bar down. Having that for the whole group would be incredible, to be honest. Oh wow, that is doing absolutely dumb damage. Yeah, while he's down like that, that's doing stupid damage. Yeah, that's decimating that guy, that's incredible. Hey, there's the high five I was looking for. All right, top everybody off real quick. Actually, it looks like they're all healed, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Come back to my healing circle, top yourself off there, Kratos, and we're good to go. Sounds like goblins from the R-rated anime. Yeah, 100%. There's a hobgoblin right there. Ow. Do you spy a hobgoblin now? I was going to hit him with lightning, but you guys kind of just did the job, so that works, I guess. Mine is now a Meister Fighter, which basically has Dragon Smile from the first game. Ooh, that's awesome. Yeah, I really do hope that they have, um... I really hope that they do have cross-platform pawns, because I, I could have sworn they said that they were going to. Yeah, lightning, lightning's pretty legit. Let's hold off for a second. Recover some stamina. Oop, not jump, because that's entirely useless. Nice. I forgot that I opened a drink a moment ago, and I just haven't done anything with it. Oh, another mundane camping kit awesome another thing to weigh me down incredible the statue makes for a fine landmark let us make our way over to it while it is in our sights oh somebody's getting attacked ow yo hold up yo chillax bro no i never agreed to this You only need one camping kit until it gets attacked and then it breaks. One of us has been That's not who I wanted to do that on. 
I need to cancel that real quick. Come on, get those reses up. Oh, that didn't get... Oh, he was just a little too far away, damn. I need to put a healing down as soon as I get him up. Or I'm just going to get absolutely decimated into the ground. That works too. Get out of here, you stupid freaking Saurian. Their tails definitely don't come off in this game, like, at all, it seems. Even though that should be their weak point. Yeah, I'm sure they still do, but it's just incredibly hard to get them off. At least for a mage. Go on, take it. I'll not take no for an answer. Ooh, 900 gold. Don't mind if I do. Ooh, a golden trove beetle. Absolutely. Let's increase that weight capacity. Yes, please. Where did that end up? Wait, did somebody wait. Hold on. Is that... Did we not get it? It said we got one. No? Did it go to Chester? No. Did it not register in my inventory? Ah. For some reason, it went to rock. Give, yes. Mm, there it is. Use, yes. Sweet. Been cutting them off left and right. It has to be with a blade. Gotcha. To be here, yeah, that makes it uh, that makes it much harder for me to do. Because I don't have a blade. Oh, there's a camp here. Cool. Make camp. Yes. Hey, Dark Lord Sylvia. Or Sylvie. How we doing? Mundane camping kit. Why are these both the same weight if one's basically garbage? Liable to collapse if... Okay. Sure. How's it going? How's it going? Welcome in. Interested in some uh, Dragon's Dogma? Having a great time here. So far. Doing good. That's awesome to hear. I'm doing good. We're doing swell. I trust so far. Inspected our equipment. So far, no complaints out of me. Having a blast playing this game, honestly. Learning it, getting destroyed. Having a good time while doing it. Hey, how's it going, Indian Magic? How we doing, man? How we doing? Welcome in, Raiders. Looks like you were playing uh, that weed shop game. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Never played any of those games, but I imagine they're pretty fun. That's awesome. If you guys haven't, uh, you guys haven't checked out the Indian Magic, he's a pretty chill dude. Likes to play a lot of games. He has quite the variety going on. He has a little bit of everything for everyone. So if you haven't checked him out, definitely worth a look. Wrapped up the little impromptu 12 hour. Nice. That's what's up. We're kind of doing a impromptu 24 hour as well. So I feel you. How'd it go though? I stopped in for a little bit and saw you were playing some uh, some of that deer game. Pass it on, absolutely. That's what's up. I appreciate that. Oh, deer is fantastic. Quite a lot of fun for what it is. Oh yeah, for sure. It looked like basically like prop hunt to a degree, but it was just like deer version, which is funny. Our task is complete. I thank you for coming to our aid. That was and what luck, Marius. Oh, okay. Many thanks for healing me, Arisen. Ooh, another golden trope oh, beetle. That's what's up. I don't think actually that went to me. I think that probably went to somebody else. Whoever grabbed it. Who done stole it? It was Chester. Chester, you thief. Give it to me. Yes. I guess he could actually use it too. But screw it. I'm gonna use it. Went really great, made it worth it, and yeah, just a deer prop hunt. It's quirky. Yeah, for sure. No, it seemed like a lot of fun. It seemed like it seemed like a a good time with the, just like all the little mechanics that I had with like the the farting around and stuff like that. That seemed very hilarious. Super down for that stuff. 
I need to share some of this weight that I have right now because it's not looking great. I do have two of these camping kits, which isn't helping. Oops. oops. These weigh a crap load. I'm going to give one to Kratos. And I'm going to give one to Rock. Yeah, that literally cut our weight in half. This thing's weigh so freaking much. It's actually a problem. That's cool, though. Glad you were having a lot of fun. Glad you had a good 12-hour stream, it sounds like. Good to hear it. Is a glad thing. Get out of here, bandit. Get out of here, bandit. Oh, for sure, man. Yeah. Like I said, <laughs> your uh your freaking title stuff is always hilarious. It always it always brings me in. Whenever you uh whenever you do the little title thing, it's always hilarious. It's so it's always just so random and goofy, I like it. Lots of lurks at this hour. Oh, no worry, man. No worries. It's all good. Lurkers are always appreciated. Ah, gotcha, punk. All right, we should have one more to be able to revive Chester. Man, that spell's incredible. Kratos is full health. We need to pop one of these. We need to pop another one of these so I can get some more of that. Pick him up. I'm so glad that works. Oh, I'm so glad that works. That is incredibly useful. Just like the company? No, 100%. Yeah, no, it's it's... Yeah, it's super nice. I mean, realistically, like, even if even if nobody's responding, it's always nice to know that, like, somebody's just kind of there hanging out, you know? For sure. A little bit of a, a little bit of a backboard to have a conversation with. Alright, come get your heels. Come get your heels, folks. Chester Cheetah, level 16. Let's go, Chester. Pulling through. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we beat the devil out of it. We beating the devil out of it, all right. We getting the heels on. We're slapping them with lightning. The lightning spell seems to be pretty versatile. The fire I'm not a big fan of. The cone kind of seems like garbage, if I'm being honest. I, I do want to upgrade it just to see how well it can perform as far as damage, but that turn radius is terrible. I actually need to check that real fast because I want to, I need to see if there's a way to make it faster. I don't think there is, but um, cursor lock, constraining. Okay, that's nice. Toggle hail. That's not what I really care for. Run type toggle. Uh, toggle's fine. Game settings. Auto sheath is on. Camera, camera speed, aiming camera speed. Is that like, change the input direction? Oh, that's just that, okay. Adjust the speed of the reticle when aiming projectiles. Does that count as like my spell stuff though? Oh, you can change the camera distance, awesome. Catching up to you, interesting. Well, I mean, we're going for 24 hours, so we, we might have some time here on our hands. Um, while aiming projectiles. Okay. I'm assuming... Let's bump this up and then see if that does anything. Yes. Because if, if we can speed that up, that's going to be incredible. No, that, that doesn't seem to have sped it up at all. Gotta rest. Leave it up to you. That took it out of you for sure. Absolutely. Well, I appreciate that raid, man. You get yourself some good rest, and uh, I'm sure I'll see you later on. I appreciate that raid, by the way. I do appreciate that. Welcome in, everybody that came in with Indian magic. You guys are lurking, no worries. But yeah, get yourself some sleep. 
Like I said, I'm sure we'll catch up at some other point. Most definitely. Okay, so there was another setting potentially that could do it. I want to mess with that too. So interface, no, it was uh, interface, no, it was camera. Okay, so aiming, camera speed, well, aiming. Is that counting as aiming though? I don't think it would, right? Weird. Because we bumped that up. Projectile aiming. For aiming. Hmm. Sounds good. Heck yeah. Indian magic. Appreciate it, man. Get yourself some good sleep. Appreciate you, man. I've been aiming a bow. Does it, maybe this is it? I'm going to try bumping all this up. I mean, I'm going to have to turn this down absolutely if I ever end up going on bow. Because it's probably going to be pretty crazy, but... I'm just thinking... That's the only thing I could think of. Interesting when aiming projectiles. Yeah, we're going to just bump all these up and see if anything helps. Because it is so bad to move that. Okay, that didn't help at all, so. Interesting. Alright. A treasure chest. Oh, I can hardly wait to open it. Let us hope your curiosity will be rewarded. I do like that though, being able to turn oh, so God, quickly while that's that aiming. Shot. So I'm fine with that. I'm fine with no, keeping it high that. like that. But actually there's a chest up there. Let's take a look at that. Absolutely. I'm sure we can get up there too. What goodies await us there, unless it's up on that ridge, which maybe. Yeah, it looks like it might be up there. Might be able to get around, though, eventually. Nope, it's right there. I already got it. I hate how it still shows up on the map after it's been looted. I wish it didn't do that. Guard all you want. It won't make a difference when I grapple you, see? I did forget to speak with Mildred, yeah. I did forget to do that. I did, I did. It'll happen at some point. I got sidetracked, and then I forgot you put the instructions in chat, and I definitely didn't remember them. My memory is absolutely that of a goldfish, so... Ouch, you punk. Okay, I'm getting screwed by the camera. Glub, glub. <laughs> exactly. That's the best way to put it, really. The battle's over, so we can cancel that. This is a town, though, it looks like. So that's kind of nice. Ruined settlement. Uh, is there bandits here? Is that a bandit? That is a bandit. Long range. Oh yeah, we got archers down pack with this lightning. Oh, he got flung. Holy smokes! This is a camp too, actually. It looks like, anyways. Yeah, we can make camp here, but we do have to get rid of all these guys first. One might confidently call oh, that a resounding victory. Of course, as soon as I round the corner, that would go off. <laughs> we all know you talk like Hulk Hogan. Nah. I do not. I'm gonna this. Right where I want you. Okay, that's not exactly what I wanted to do, but whatever. Oh, dude, this is so awful to control. Hey, vocation rank up, let's go. We achieved remarkable synchronicity. I just think what we could achieve if we honed our talents further. 
Better search this chest in the middle of combat. You'll see that often. I, I do that regularly. That is, if I see loot, I have to have it. Even if I get smacked. A trait, a trait I picked up from Dark Souls. We've never found one. Our collection grows. Interesting. I shall have to inform my own master of this. Thought I had this game downloading, but it wasn't. Oh no, okay, well that's not good. That's not good at all. Alright, let's make camp. I'm assuming it's fine. Modest. Why do I have three modest camping kits? What the hey? That's so much weight, dude. That's insane. Let's top up. So sad. Yeah, I'm big oof. It does suck. Hate to hear that it's not uh, working for you. Or that it wasn't downloading. Because that's a bummer. What are you shooting? Are you trying to shoot the various birds that are running around? I guess, Chester. Cheetah's gotta eat. No harm in picking a few. There's plenty of harm. Oh, hello. Oh, I'm trying, but the turning on that is terrible. See, when these guys want to work together, it's fine. They just like working together on one person, but when it comes to just like multiple targets, they just they just lose all all ability to coordinate. A wolf just attacked you in the middle of town square. That's that's oh, insane. Well spotted. That's crazy. I'm sure my master would be astonished to learn this is here. Sure would. Have a clip of it as well. <laughs> if you're in the Discord, you're more than welcome to throw it in there. That'd be hilarious to see, I'm sure. Okay, let's check this map out. Let's see. Okay, so we gotta go around and about that way. Okay, so it seems like we've discovered a lot of whatever this area was, so that's fine. I do kind of want to make a stop back at town just so I can see what other vocation skills that I was able to get. I, I also want to purchase the higher version of the fire because it seems to be kind of the only thing that works. Let us endeavor to keep up, though we are less fleet of foot. I don't know why I'm so much faster than you guys. Apparently. There it is. There's that discord. I don't have any, like, specific tabs for, like, individual games, so you can just throw it pretty much wherever. General picks anything. Or games. There's also a games tab. Either one really works. Yeah. Anything will do. Not particularly picky. I have a knack for gathering items, and am ever on the hunt for new finds. Ronnie, huh? I'll gladly try out any useful mechanisms I espy. Nah. We don't need another sorcerer on the team. I get bullied enough for the lot of us. Is that another griffin? Very interesting. I overheard Gonna come over to your house and play here as well mine downloads. <laughs> I mean, oh, you know. Did it pertain to the Queen Regent and an important personage, perchance? How are we to get through this door? Do you not have, uh, do you not have very good internet to download it pretty quick? I'm assuming. Okay, well, or you're just gonna dip and I'm stuck burning absolutely nothing. Cool, love that. Need this. Come here, punk. Can you stop running away? That'd be great if you could stop that. Hour and a half, I think. Need to sleep by then? Yikes. That's terrible. Let us see what you made of. Let's burn those wings. Burn them. Crisp them up. It's 
get some toasted griffin going on in here. Just kill it? Yeah, exactly. Just kill it. Makes sense. That's the easiest thing to do. Just give it a good die real fast. Are we burning that? We roasting that noggin. Oh, that does so much damage, dude. Stop playing with the griffin, kill it already. <laughs> oh, we're, we're cooking him. We're getting roast bird today. Oh, he's gonna run away like a punk. There's almost 100% chance. Die them now. <laughs> Makes sense. We're crisping him. Looks like he's enjoying. Are you trying? Oh yeah. I mean, he's got. He must have a. He must have a fire kink. He's a special kind of griffin. You know what I mean? He's uh. He's into the flames. It's not specifically stated, but. It's a, it's a secret kink they've got going on. They're so majestic in this game. Oh, 100%. They're way cooler in this game than they were in the first game. There's still a bunch of wieners, though. They run away, like, freaking every two seconds. Even though I'm cooking this guy, like, freaking Thanksgiving dinner. But he's still gonna run away like a hoe. Thank you, Arisen. Friggin' wiener. Griffins, man, I tell you. What a pussy. He was getting cooked, then he just... He said, I'm out. He said, see you later. I don't even like entertaining battles with griffins because they just they just freaking leave every time. It just it's a whole waste of time. Like there's there's like legitimately no way to get them to stay. Like I was cooking that man's wings and he just dipped anyways. No problem, noob. Get good. <laughs> nah, no, I, I get I get bullied quite often still in this game as a mage. Actually slapped. Who are you there? No. Who's the one requesting? I didn't ask. It is none of my concern. The f okay, well, can you stop randomly talking to me? I have an agenda. Good sir. Six levels under you? Yeah. Yeah. 100%. Which is also another thing that I wanted to do in town. Um, Because I wanted to acquire some new skills because my vocation leveled up. Um... And yeah, what is this? Silence is the target, preventing them from speaking and encanting spells. Okay. That seems okay, but not really the best. Fire affinity, advance the grants longer lasting enchantment. That's kind of nice. I'll let him. Um... Okay, so that gets rid of certain things like that. Gotcha. So... That kind of seems like it's not going to be very useful where I'm at right now. So I do want to upgrade this because absolutely. And then upgrading High Palladium because that gives the squad extra defense, which is incredible. So we're absolutely going to do that. Reduces the duration of debilitations you're affected with. That's kind of nice. Yeah, that's not, that's not bad at all. Yeah, so originally originally Chester was a mage, um, but having two mages proved to be kind of a pain in the ass. So I stopped that. Pin targets to walls? That sounds awesome. Drenching shot. Explodes after a time or attack, drenching the target and those who are near it. Usable only when carrying an applicable arrow. Oh, that kind of sucks. We're going to definitely go with Deathly Arrow because it's an upgrade. get out of here let's get out of here yeah so 
I did um I did a thief and uh a fighter. I did two fighters earlier. Uh and it worked okay. But yeah, I mean the, the thief thing seemed to work pretty decent. But we'll see we'll see who's on the board today. Alright, sorry, Kratos, you've been great. A grand adventure awaits us. Nope. Just know Sorry, Fox, I don't that's not who I wanted. I enjoy tackling fierce foes. Dismiss. Prefer... You're gonna have a fresh apple. Yes, sir. Days traveled ten. Choose a rating. Be Art. well, Arisen. I'm not... Love the Kratos. He looked very much like he should. Okay, where's the other dude? Rock. I'll serve with redoubled vigor this day. Yeah, no, it's super cool. It's 100% like way better than the first game to enter this rift. Here, you can have a fish. Eight I days traveled. Say, I've accomplished it. Okay, <clears throat> so what level are we now exactly? We are 16. Okay, so we need at least a 16 pawn. Okay, let's just look for a level 16. You can have a fish, you scrub. Hey, here's the thing. Fish is delicious, and it's good for you. So, I think that's a pretty good gift, personally. But, hey, you know what? To each their own, okay? Alright. Advanced pawn search level... Can we change this? Minimum level 18. Maximum level 8. Actually, no, we need to be 16. Because, yeah. We, I don't want to spend any rip credits right now. All of you get out of here except for Chester. Chester's the only homie at the moment. Burn. Okay, we don't really need another mage though. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Welcome to the party, Please Jack. Dispense with the formalities. And then who else do we got? Abel, Bo, Abby, Tom, um, Anita, Theo. Zoe, Cody, Kane. It's good and it's good for you. That doesn't detract from Rock being a scrub. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Rock's not a scrub. He did his job half the time. Black Kisser, interesting. Tom. Okay. Um... Should we get an archer or should we get another fighter? Because we already have an archer. I'm thinking I want another fighter so I can have even more aggro. Let's get ace. You can count on me to fly to your aid in your hour of need. Yes. If ever you've need of an aid. Specializations. Yes, you told me about this earlier. Yeah, so I did search by level, um, which is what I searched by. So we're good there. All right, let's get the hay out of here. We might scratch another task off our list while we're here, if we are so inclined. When the mind is split, the heart must lead. Oops. All right, Sven, where's my payment? Pay up. Boy, friend, there's something I've come to understand during my stolen hours. Experience. Every last resident in this city is wholeheartedly devoted to living out their lives. It seems a simple observation, I know, but to me, for it made me painfully aware of my own position. I want to live a life I can proudly call. I tire of enduring my mother's. <clears throat> the thing about it is, is he also a spy, though? Or is he just acting? Hmm. Looking at this box, it fills me Even with. Even make the search super specific, there are still tons of bombs within your parameters that show up. So many people have been playing this game. Yeah, no, I, I know it allows you to do both. That I am not my mother's but servant. I just wanted to do the level, and if I didn't get what I needed, then I I would have just done what I needed. But tis something I obtained of my own will. Here is the last of the gold I owe you. Pray now, I'd best be off. I may not be able to wander the city again for some time. There's aught I would do. Thus, I cannot say when next we'll see each other. So Interesting. I feel sure we shall in time. Till then. Take care. Take huh? care, friend. So many pawns for so many levels. Oh yeah. I mean, I'm sure there's tons of people playing. Courtly tunic and breeches. Does are those better? I'd love to see if those are better. 
They're not. They're quite worse. Yeah, quite, quite worse. I do like the appearance of them, though. I don't like this hat that I'm wearing, if I'm being completely honest. That procuring it was not a burden upon the I look like a freaking pilgrim. Or like a basic villager. Welcome to and quality is what you need if you want to survive. Bye. What kind of helmets do you have? You've got the serpentine circlet, which I kind of am thinking about. Guard plate armor? I can't even wear that. Why did it? I thought it said I could wear that for a second, but no. Okay, so I kind of want to buy this because I like the look of it. And it's... How is that heavier than a wizard's hat? I guess it's probably made of, like, more metal, I guess. Mm, that's slightly better, and I kind of like it over the shawl look, so I'm just going to pony up for the money. Can I wear two of these? I'm going to try buying two of these, just to see if I can wear two of them. And if I can't, then I'll just give it to Chester. So before you check the price, hope to see you again. These writings could be... Yeah, see, that, that looks so much better. A thorough perusal might reveal aught of interest. Jack. Hold on. I'm, I'm busy, Jack. I'm busy experimenting. Chillax. Whip on the left hand, I think? Yeah, okay, so you can equip two. Let me see, does it... Hold on, does it make it more? Yes, it totally stacks. Okay, that's awesome. Can't remember if I did it on... Okay, that's great. That's awesome. That's incredible. I appreciate that drastically. I guess uh, I guess Chester can have this one then. That way he can have a little bit extra health. Because I absolutely need the extra weight. Curious, if I take like a month break from the game, how many RC I'll log into? Yeah, for sure. All right, Jack, what's the dealio? Come on, buddy, where are we going? Okay, so we're just going. Gotcha. All right, well, I'm gonna heal Chester because I don't, I don't know what happened to him, but he got hurt somehow. Just when I needed it oh, most. he didn't get hurt. He got the ring that gave him extra health. But I guess that makes sense. Yeah, no, I'm sure, I'm sure RC will definitely be a, a, a high number if you stayed off for like a month or so, because there's gonna be a ton of people playing this game regardless of all the bad reviews. Because the first one already had a decent community as it was, and a lot of them still probably like this game. So, at the very least, you'll have at least those players, along with a pretty decent amount of other people that uh, will join in regardless. Oh yeah, that does a decent bit more damage. I don't know why that destroyed my stamina more than it should have, though, I feel like. Oh, that's great. Yeah, that allows everybody to get a little boon. That's incredible. Ooh, where's that high five, Chester? That was impeccable oh, time Sure was. Is that a bandit? Nope. Just a pawn. I hate how sometimes you can't tell the difference. At least I can't. Like, sometimes it's pawns, sometimes it's bandits. So I'm always wary of like, basically everybody that I encounter. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, old wager. We could pick some now and Die use now. them when the need arrives. One of us has been trenched. Okay, so that's a pretty good distance away, to be honest with you. You could be pretty far away still, and they would still get the buff. That spell right there is going to be, like, 
clutch constantly. Being able to give the entire group a three hit shield constantly is stupidly good. That's so, so good. Where are we going, Jack? Where exactly is it that you're trying to lead me, sir? You wanted to go one way, and now we're going another way. Is that the blue bubble ability? No. Mm -mm. The blue bubble ability is just getting rid of debilitations. This is a shield on its own. This is a whole other ability by itself. Yeah, get roasted punks. It's really nice, though. It's the uh, upgraded version. So the regular version doesn't give everybody um, a shield. It just gives you a personal shield. But when you upgrade it, it gives everybody within the radius a little a little ball. Was this ops cart assailed? Yeah, two different parties attacking you. It's kind of annoying, but I'm, I'm telling you, with this thing, it's it's so nice. Would be wise, but we ought not let it halt us in our course. Give me that tail punk. Oh, get roasted, toasted. There he goes. Yo, you have a pawn that uses it? Yeah, you must have a mage on your team then. It's incredibly helpful for keeping the party topped up. Have to have one in this game, not the first game. Yeah, so, so far... Wait, uh, that's not what I want to me. That's not what I meant to do. Thank you, Master. I feel much better now. <clears throat> there you guys go. At least tap the healing circle. Jeez, making my life hard here. Give everybody a shield, and then we can encounter these wolves here. Get toasted. Yeah, that makes life so much easier. So much easier. When is your next burrito review? Um, probably never. I'll be honest. You've my gratitude. You're not. You're not supposed to show stolen goods. Okay. That's what fences are for. Exactly. I don't I don't procure them the natural way. So I can't review things, obviously. It's gotta it's gotta be kept secret. I'm getting some burritos after donating today. Still got eight hours until I gotta go. Gotcha. Heck yeah, get that burrito. Burritos are like my favorite food in like in the world. Like we have found a material. That that question that people normally ask of like if there was one thing in the world that you could only ever eat one like for the rest of your life, burritos would be it for me. A hundred percent. I'll eat burritos all day long. Talking about burritos made my stomach grumble. Yeah, that's understandable. We're going this way now. I they're they're quite the delicious food. A cave. Meat, cheese, and a tortilla. That's all you need, really. It doesn't matter which of which. Literally any combination of of those ingredients, and you're set.
a roasted goblin. Eight packs of frozen burritos, spicy burritos, chimichangas, they even have breakfast burritos. Nice. See, the kind of burritos that I typically like to go for is like when I go to like a restaurant. Those are the those are the type of burritos that I usually prefer. I don't mind frozen burritos either, but they're they're definitely not my favorite, I wouldn't say. Get roasty toasty, Harpy. So the heck is this other one? Or is he down already? Also, why are you going off on your own, Jack? What are you doing? Come here. In the cave we go, good sir. Yeah, but no, I'll, I'll pretty much eat a burrito anytime. There's like pretty much never a time I'd say no to a burrito. Unless I was already just like insanely full already. Each, diff each has a different sauce slavered on top. That sounds delicious. See, the thing about it is I like spice with it, too. So it's like, if I could have both, perfect. Nailing it right on the head right there. That's the combo. That's the combo. Is this where we need to be? I don't know if this is actually the cave. This might be, though. Two of them are spicy sauces, one is verde and the other one is queso. Gotcha. Ow. Don't mind me as I just stand here and get slapped. What are you doing, dude? Well, I guess you're getting cooked. I don't know what else to tell you, buddy. Indecisions get burnt. Yeah, that sounds delicious, though. I'm all down for spice and burritos. Chester, are you stuck back there? You sure are. Let's top off. I'm saved, master. And it's all thanks to you. Yeah, that shield is incredible. It's doing wonders for keeping the party healed up. Get cooked like a burrito. <laughs> exactly. Actually, that's not what I meant to do, but it's fine. It still works all the same. That exhausts me, but it's completely fine because I can't get hit three times, so that's perfectly acceptable. Oh, there's an up section to this place? I didn't even realize that. Do you get there through here? No. How the heck do I get up there? Interesting. Yes, no. Like, yes, no to a quick burrito? I have no idea how I get up there. I clearly have to get up there, but... Is responding to my questions in real time? I don't even remember what I said, so... There's there's a great chance that I, I couldn't tell you what I was asking. Use my mini-map. I'll harvest what I can, should it please you. No, oh, we're using the mini-map. I just don't see any way to get up there. Is it this way, maybe? We're exhausted. Hold on. Our task is complete. Uh, okay. I guess we're done. I didn't even do anything up there, but I guess we're done here. So, all right. Less things for me to do. To attend to. Also, I think it's been about I think it's been about an hour. So. Boop. I think it's itchy after a while. 
We were to make for half I definitely don't mind having it on, but it just gets itchy. So. Alright, just one more place to go, and then uh, that's all the goblins, eh? I definitely want to explore the map more, but I also don't want to uh, get absolutely clobbered by everything. Sanic. I'm getting it. We're getting it. Absolutely. Okay, should we camp out though? of the cave at last? Oh, hey, there's a griffin just chilling up there. Tale of adventure would be complete without a good cave. It's probably a complete waste of time to try to bother them. But if I go back to the cave, I could tell you how to get up there. It's hard to describe by watching you. I'm sure I could find it if I tried, but I'm not worried about it at the moment. If I'm being completely honest. Have a gander at my wares. You shan't regret. I'll have a gander, sure. Since I have rotten stuff, I might as well drop that off because it's no use to me. Oh, wait, did I? No, I, I did equip that. Then. Oh, it's because, yeah. So I want to sell this because I hated the way that looked. Uh, I think I can give this over to Chester, so I'm not going to do anything about that. Hope to see you again here long. Nothing really up there. Staff you get from the cave is when you give the guy to complete the vocation for Oh, you sold it? Oof, dude. Ah. Nice. That's terrible. Although that's 100% something that I would do, so I feel your pain. Alright, well I don't think that's how that's supposed to work, but we did it anyways. Skyrim! Unintentionally climbing mountains. Mm. I wouldn't say this seems like a decent spot for a campsite. That's, yeah, that's, no, that, I don't share that same opinion. There's a griffin here. I wonder if this is his nest. If this is his nest, he probably won't go away, I'd assume. Get roasted, Griffin. Frick. Alright, I need to top everybody up with this because, yeah. And then get some heals going. This should be a I basically just need to keep everybody topped off with a shield. That's basically all I need to do. And then this guy can't do anything. Oh, it's roasty time. We're gonna roast this griffin like Thanksgiving dinner. He's getting cooked. We're having cooked bird today. Potentially. If he stops all that nonsense. I'm tired. Hold on. Hold on. Items. Oh, we're gonna roast that noggin of yours for a second until you get back up, but it's fine. I need to give everybody another shield. I really do wonder if this is actually his nest or not. I hope it is, so that way he just stops trying to run away. Oh, it's time to get roasted today, bird. We having some roast griffin. Hey, we got one health bar down. Oh, 
Oof, that hurt terribly bad. Okay, I thought I still had my shield, but I guess he got rid of it in like one blow. That's not good for my health, literally. We might as well use these. Save myself some inventory space. I definitely should not be this close to this Gryphon, but screw it. Playing the risky game today. Come on, roast those wings. Roast them. Is he causing lightning? He sure is. Okay. Okay, so you definitely don't want to be near those circles. Causes a whole load of lightning. Okay, so he's still going to screw off, huh? Maybe. Nope, oh, he's just going in for a dive bomb. Come on, buddy, come on. You know you just want to get roasty toasty. You want to just get a little cozy with some fire. I know you do. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, wow, that. That did a lot of damage. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on down. All right, his wings are toasted. Let me get this guy up. Blueberry down, blueberry down. Just upgraded opponent's gear level to two. Uh, three. She's going to be pumping out damage. Absolutely. Wait, where did that griffin go? Oh, he fell down here? That's the worst spot to fall. Are you kidding me? That's so bad. We're not going to be able to get any damage in. I mean, we're going to get a little in, but not as much as I would like. And there's also a cliff here, so. He's back up now. That's kind of a punk move. This should be close enough to everybody, hopefully still. Thank you for healing. I got you. A little roasty toasty on the griffin. I'm gonna try to keep him burnt. Try to see if I can keep his wings toasted. Because that should keep him grounded. Everybody needs another one of these just in case you get hit by lightning. Oof. That hurt quite a bit, but the healing was able to heal him through it. All right, come on, Griffin. Don't go away now. Don't do it. You're, you're one health bar down. Nah, he's screwing off, I think. Bummer, dude. Griffins suck, man. Griffins absolutely suck. The moment I've been waiting for. Okay, well, we're going to camp since that took basically all day. I don't want to be wandering around at night. Modest camping kit. Yes. <clears throat> Till morning. So I'm absolutely not trying to get attacked in the middle of the night. That sucks. Super hard. All right, let's get out, guys. Yeah, I need to remember to regularly upgrade my pawns every like couple levels because they get outdated. Do let me know if you need a hand. Which is unfortunate. I do kind of wish they leveled up with you. I mean, I guess you could like favorite them and then just recall them because the other players are probably playing and leveling them up. They just don't level up in real time. Only what the hell's that sound? Away. Oh, it's one of these guys. Oh, God.
Hey, good thing I had that. What are you, what are you doing? Yeah, punk, how do you like that? I got a shield. Can't grab me with a shield on. You little prick. Makes this so much easier. But assured. Pop another one of those. Yeah, this this thing's definitely got to be like my favorite spell in the whole game right now. That shield is way too useful. The fact that it blocks grabs is just silly. That's incredibly useful. Let's boot scoot and boogie King <laughs> Yatta. <laughs> Throw up a heal, even though I don't think anybody needs it, but. Considering picking up Archer to unlock augments, but it's like going from a powerful to a weakling again. Yeah. I mean, archers are pretty strong, though. From what I've gathered. Our foe stumbles. Just one more push will bring it down. Am I not pressing E? There we go. That shield is so, so good, dude. I can't even praise it enough. Hey, come here, punk. What are you doing? Where are you running to? Let him go, punk. It's so hard to let people go. It's all good. We got our shield on. We're good. We're good. Yeah, this basically keeps the, the party invincible, almost. Which is insane. Tried to hit me, too bad I got a shield. No, we burning today. That doesn't seem to do any more damage when he's down, but I'll take the extra damage. Well, he can't do anything about it. Holy shite. We're chilling. And he's getting roasted this time around. We're doing so much better. Turns out Chimera in the game, someone borrowed my pawn and died to a Chimera. She expressed that she didn't want to face one again. Oh man. I, I'm not surprised that they're in the game. I, I would honestly be more shocked if they weren't in the game. They're kind of like a staple. Yeah, that was made so easy and the party didn't even really take any damage. Yeah, we're all like basically topped off. I'm going to heal us because there's a little bit of topping off to do, but... For the most part, everyone's good. As much as we can carry. That's incredible, dude. That shield is wicked. 
really, really good. Some borrowed my opponent still died to a command that must be a force to be reckoned with compared to Griffins. Oh yeah, 100%. I wouldn't doubt it. Well, because they can cast magic, so... Some pretty intense magic at that. Sure was. Oh yeah, dude. This is the way for sure, man. I think I might just have to freaking play mage like all the time now, just because of this. I do want to mess with other vocations, but dude, ugh, the shield is just so freaking useful. The chance you'd like to see it. So so useful. Uh, immediately after your pawn makes a suggestion, we'll probably follow through with their idea or assist with the task. Pawns are helpful creatures by nature. Okay. Is that a statue I espy over yonder? Well, we have a place to go to. Afterwards, we can go wherever. Sure, we shall have to make our way over to it. <clears throat> the creature's corpse will serve us well. Oh yeah, Griffins. Strike Griffins were definitely more powerful than, than Chimera. They also ran away a lot more too in the other game. I feel. All right, I guess about the same, <clears throat> if we're being honest. But yeah, I don't know. Ooh, nice. Our village. I feel like there was something to do here, potentially. Maybe. We'll see, I guess. Is there any sort of... No more or less than what one might have expected. Okay, well, this is busted up, so there's definitely not going to be an inn here, I'm sure. Travel together for a day and night. Ooh, nice. How does that sound? Pray, follow me. Oh, I can sit and wait here. Okay. I don't really want to do that, though. What is that noise? Not that. Very no. Well. I, shall return. I don't know where you're trying to go, but not right now. I'm trying to investigate what's going on here. Is there anything in this hut? Sure is. Some thr threshing blaze and fulgurous lord. Okay. What is this? I'm only funny. Interesting. Euphony? Euphony? I don't know. One of the two. Something. Is there a chest at the top of this hill? That'd be incredible. Probably not. It's probably just some fruit. Yep. What do you know? That's so cool. Looks so so much cooler in this one. Just the effects of it. Let me be the one to collect it. There's a wandering peddler over here. Interesting. What goodies does this guy have? We could also sell to this guy if we need to. I can't think of anything I need to sell at the moment, but we could. Oh, my house. Can we get in here? We sure what can. You. I'd not say no to a short repose hereabouts. Perhaps we might take a moment. Ooh, a goodie box. Savor the scene. Oh yeah. As you say. Ooh, another goodie box. Look at that. Winter's path. I'm assuming that's some sort of ice spell. Over here. The fact that you can stack rings is just impeccable to me. Worm's life crystal? What the heck is that? Hold on. What does that do? Is that a material? Yeah, it is. Okay. Used in high order enhancements. Interesting. I don't think I've gotten one of those before. Okay. That's great. That's incredible, actually. Make sure I already went through there. Yeah, I still don't like the camera in tight quarter, like, spaces like this. It kind of screws with my head a little bit, I'm going to be honest. Especially when you get closer to a wall. And it really messes me up. Ooh, goody. That looks like a nice-looking chest. What do we got? A wake stone shard. Nice. I must know. 
Okay, so that's three wake stones now. Treasure, you know? I feel like the wake stones are much more common in this game so far. <clears throat> like, they weren't as common in the beginning of um, Dragon's Dogma 1, but as you got to the end portion of the game, it seemed like they were really common. I could have just been missing them, but that seemed like my experience. At least for me. I have anything to sell? My, I interest you in my hump. You can have my rotten stuff that I can no longer carry, which is actually just one thing. So. Bullwares. Yeah, that's fair. For the first one, I was kind of just doing a lot of like story bum rushing. Nothing to tempt us with. Our funds are better spent elsewhere. <clears throat> Browsing was enough to scratch the itch, in my case. What are we doing here, exactly? Oh, you've come to a dangerous place. Scaly beasts make this their den. We've been dispatched to cull them. Doesn't look like you're doing much of your job, then. A small force ventured inside. Though I've seen neither heart... I'll not stop you if you wish <clears throat> to explore. But don't look for... What a wiener. There's a haze of... What? Okay, the audio just like cut out all of a sudden. Oh, hey, there's a crystal. God, damn blizzard. Nice. I still don't have any fairy stones, but... Aged. Hey, he looks crazy. I'll take your book. Oh, that's right. I was telling you about the Gigantus. Now, listen well. The Gigantus is an earthen structure that hearkens to the voice of the sea. Tis a servant of the brine, huh? Just as the arisen commands the pawns, supposedly the brine have their colossal servant as for what the brine deem an act of excess. Some would argue that tis the hand. But what of it? Those unbidden sips of ale are what keep the throat from growing parched. That brings me back to what I was saying about the, uh, tis formed of clay. And tall enough this guy's to just rambling on about a bunch of junk, it seems. By the voice of the sea. Meg, you do not believe. But I assure you. Yeah, it's just a ramblings of a crackhead over here. Might come in useful. Okay, where's, where's the entrance to said we cave? Oh, down here. Gotcha. I see. Spooky. All right, pawns. I'm gonna need your assistance down here. A mage is not the one to be going in the front. I tell you what. Say no to drugs, kids. You'll end up like the cracked semen on the beach. Gleam of treasure. I cannot help but want to claim it, however far it may be from our goal. I dare say that's part and parcel of the adventurous trade. We are under attack! How to let the enemy gain the upper hand? The early griffin gets the worm, as they say. The early griffin? Griffin always gets the worm because the griffin always runs away afterwards. That's what the saying should be. Yeah, magic doesn't seem to really do very much to these guys. I mean, lightning seems to do the best out of everything. But lightning just kind of seems to do the best just in general, so... Not a terrible surprise. A flawless execution. Would that we might always be... I am in... Okay, so there's more further, huh? Have you a different destination in mind, Master? Very well. The three silver I shall is nice. your lead instead. The Arisen is capricious indeed. You have my admiration. I doubt even my own master has Ooh, obtained an article so rare. Nice. Ooh, a goodie box. What's in here today? Savagery extract. Sure. I'll take that. Why not? 
Yeah, it has pretty good range. I mean, it didn't reach Chester over there, but... We shall have to crane on next to spot our foes in a place like this. Keep your voice low, lest my heart leap from my throat. I feel like you should have... I don't know. I, I can see how that could be like a jack voice, but I also kind of feel like it should have been a little deeper. But you are kind of limited by the vocation, so, you know, limited options, unfortunately. Ooh, what's down here? Check this out. This looks cool. That sounds bad. Like a hydra down here? It works with all classes, yeah. It it looks like a knight armor set though. It's like a generic looking knight armor set to me. Seems to me we'll find some rare materials here. Which don't get me wrong, it looks cool, but that's quite a discovery. It's not very good in terms of armor. Lots of goodies down here. Ooh, a Saurian scale cape. That looks cool. Let's check that out. Ah, oh, dude, that's pretty decent. It's worse, though. It does have striking resistance, but that kind of makes me look cool. Gotta say. Yeah, it's a decent starter set for whatever you end up switching to. I don't like how the, like, ponchos in this game are so bulky. Like, they just, like, float. As if they've been hung out to dry and just got, like, stale or crusty. But they have, like, waviness to them, so it's, like, clearly that that's not the case. But it's, like, they look like that for some reason. Uh, equipment. I'm gonna give this to... Chester. Oh, he can't equip this? Why? He's an archer, is he not? So, why can't he equip that? Okay. Is it specific to maybe, like, a specific room? Or, like, the person only? Let's try this other one, I guess. I can't equip that either. Yeah, it's not bad to upgrade. That makes sense for sure. Well, I guess he can't equip a cape then. That kind of sucks. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything over here. At least that I can tell. I do want to try this, though. Just for the sake of trying it. It looks like there's a gate over there, but we're going to try it anyways. Nope. That's not what I wanted. Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything over there, but I wanted to try it. Had to at least check to know, right? I'll harvest what I can, should it please you. Well, I guess it was worth it for the cool looking cape. Figures. Are we leaving already? Bother. I was just getting warmed up. I'm gonna cast another one so that everyone can get one. Let's toast that tail. Yeah, that got him. Top everybody off. <clears throat> Let's get out of here. I figured there was gonna because I heard the I heard their noise earlier. So I was gonna say there's gotta be something that attracts us down here. Which 100 percent makes sense.
And we're tired. We'll take a little break. It's fine. Yeah, I should do pretty decent on them. Perfect. Are you so eager to chat with me? At five. I thought we did enough of that on the road. Nope. I'm one of ours. Not that eager to talk to you, actually. To save us, forgive me. I cannot seem to walk of my own accord just now. Would you aid me in reaching the entrance? That's an interesting here, Stone. I don't remember seeing that. There's a chest here, though. I'll take that. Goodies. Oh, I could have got a certain. Do you mind coming over here? Yeah, of course I paid for that. And now I. Okay. See? Of course. As soon as I pay for this, it happens to be in a chest where I go. Gosh dang it. That would happen. Okay. These well. obstacles shan't get the better of us. There must be a way to remove them. Rain of the packs are my specialty master. Oh, nice. Shall I assist? A fairy well, stone. Now, hey, nice. Seen, I. That's now, great. Why I shall never tire of our adventures. That's incredible. Are you just like limping your way over here, or what's supposed to do with you? Yeah, you're just taking your sweet old time. All right, yes. Yeah, that's incredible. That's good to know there's a little secret fairy stone area over there. A tad too high, methinks. Nah. Can this guy get down from there, though, is kind of the real question. Yes, he can. Good to know. Well, he's perfectly capable of doing things, so he's fine. He's not that badly injured. The old man is strange in word and deed. Yet, I can't quite bring myself to this Mrs. Hey, Oz with the raid. How we doing, Oz? Just chatting. Heck yeah. Dragon's Dogma 2, absolutely. How was the stream? How was your stream? Were you doing some uh, editing and stuff? For your uh, your Twitch? For like alerts? Or were you doing something else? You've done well this day. Oh, thank you. We'll see to the rest of this mess. Welcome in, Alkaline and uh, Zyke. Welcome in, guys. Welcome in. Appreciate you hopping in from the raid. All right, so. Um, oh, okay. Now you have something to say. Think pressing onward if I were you. Emote art and chatting for the last bit. Nice. With Forgive me. I didn't mean to startle you. Hmm. Well, I'm startled. Call You're me startled. Risen, are you? Well, that's something. Yeah, previous raid, what raid was Dragon's Dogma 1. But now that the second one's out, we got to play it. Absolutely. We were hoping to reclaim our village. We fled when the dragon attacked some days past, thinking easier said than done, clearly. In our absence, a bot. What are we to do? The guards not like to send soldiers. Ah, but mayhap they needn't at all. Please, sir. Do something. I got you. Saurians are bound, master. The Union Guard. We'll mess up these Saurians. Ooh, hold on. I'm going to need uh, that ability real quick. Then I shall remain by your side. Nope. You guys go do your thing. Mage is coming along a lot better. I was able to get a spell that basically prevents all damage for the party as long as I keep it up. So it's going significantly better than yesterday. Innocent Sarians being slaughtered, nothing has changed. Nope. 
Nope. Don't we have a report to make, Master? Hey, there it is. There's there's the knuckles. I defeated Saurians, but that was incredibly easy. <clears throat> yeah, so it's it's called High Palladium. And essentially, whenever I cast it, I can cast it pretty quick, too. I just go like this and then speed it up. And then the whole party gets this like, little yellow orb that floats around us. And it prevents three attacks of any magnitude. It seems. I haven't tested that as far as super powerful attacks, but it seems like that. So it can block three attacks, and then I just have to reapply. And I basically have infinite health for the party. It's, it's, it's incredible. Oh, thank you. Yeah, thank basically. You. We shall all be able to ret I dare say we'll have this place livable again. I cannot thank you enough. Long will you be known. If you happen to pass by, I should like for you to see this place as twas afore the dragon's attack. Hey, nice. Oh, Wait a few days, then return to harm. Okay. Bad. We'll say we visit again anon. Ghost streamer. Spooky. Is that your say? Uh, might as well take this time to stretch, you know? Get a little bit of spook going on. Show some eyes. Because that's about the only thing you can see in this filter. <laughs> Which I like, so I'm down for it. I just see there's a door here. That's quite interesting. Is there a rift zone around this corner? Yes, there is. Okay. Alright, well, let's get out of here. Oh, wait, what do Wait, did we not? Hold on. Next from soft boss? <laughs> I don't know about that. Okay, we need to go back to Captain Brant. Okay, so basically just going back home. So I wanted to take a look at the... Uh, I wanted to take a look at this fairy stone because... Does it have multiple uses or is it just one? I'm assuming it's just one because it was one in the last game. So I'm assuming that's going to be the case now. I mean, we're probably fine to just, like, adventure for a minute. Because we're kind of already pretty far out here. So we might as well keep going. Just see what's out here. See what other loot we can obtain. What other monsters we can encounter. They are consumable like Dragon's Dogma 1. That's kind of what I figured. Almost killed the griffin. It flew off with 5% health. Oof. Man, griffins are the worst, dude. I'll gather this. I hate griffins. They're not even hard. They just run away. There, master. Harpies. Harpies indeed. Alright. Pop everybody with a shield. Heal up. And then get some lightning. Just in the middle of time. Oh, it got him nice. Yeah, that's a pretty good range, considering. If an ogre didn't jump on top of us out of nowhere, it's like the game doesn't want you to kill griffins. No, it's like griffins don't want you to kill griffins. If they weren't such a pain in the butt to deal with in the first place, they wouldn't be so much of a problem. It's just the fact that they run away that's really the, the hardest part about them. That's really their biggest issue. Offers no solace in victory. Let us pick ourselves up, dust ourselves off, and try not to slip up again. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm really not liking Griffins. Like, they're cool, and they're majestic looking, but the fact that you can you can spend some time attacking them, and then they just dip is is super annoying. Gonna be productive and not play Dragon's Dogma 2? Absolutely. Sounds good, Oz. Get your playthrough going. Oh, did he fall in the water? He sure did. Oh, so did she. The real question is, are you going to be able to get back up? 
I guess she didn't really fall in the water. She just fell in that like little lake-ish area. I guess you can get back up this way. The sun's light yeah. has grown dim. Why are you guys all going down there? Do it's a terrible place to be. To enemy ambush. <clears throat> Pop your health off and then hit those legs. Oh, he seems to be damaged already. Interesting. Seems like goblins are attacking him. I definitely want to take him out for the XP, because the XP from these guys is incredible. When the ogre jumped in, I was like, mind your own business, I'll kill you after the griffin. That's great. Hey, Nuka Quantum Addict, welcome in. How we doing? We all got a shield, so it's okay. Ah, uh, yeah. There is no more Mystic Knight. That's a bummer. That is a bummer. Maybe it would have been too OP. I don't know. I don't think so. I mean, this ability that I have as a mage is pretty insane so far. Just basically being able to keep everybody topped off for a really long time. Almost invincible. I mean, you're not invincible quite, but you're basically there. I unlock the mystic spear. Ooh, nice. Yeah, I hear I hear the mystic spear is actually incredible. From what I've heard. But why is that not doing any damage to you? Just a menace to every living being. <laughs> Lest we extinguish our lanterns before we take another step. That's nice. Innocent forest creatures. <laughs> I don't think uh, I don't think that's the same topic we're talking about here. You heavily rely on your pawns to stun down enemies, and when they are stunned, you just go full ham on them. Gotcha. That's still interesting, though. Oh, he's a stumbling. Pop everybody with a shield. Heal everybody. Yeah, I feel like stamina is not as much of an issue in this game, personally. With a warrior, a group one is a threat. With a mystic spear, it's just a dumb orb. <laughs> that's great. Oh, that's a zombie. Welcome to the party, zombie. You can catch these flames. Get that lightning. Phantoms, yeah, they're wandering about. It is that time of the night. Where those creatures be roaming. It is so dark at night, by the way, which is incredibly awful. I do like this little orb as well, because it kind of it like works as like a little light, which is great. Exactly. Put him to sleep with some nice warmth. It worked out, see? It's not all bad. We can be considerate. Love how they look, yeah. They do look really, really cool. Might there be aught over there? We ought to take a closer look. Aught, aught, aught. The heck is a chopper? Phantoms are less of an annoyance than in the first game. I haven't really noticed. 
I didn't really face too many phantoms in the first one. I feel like I'm seeing them a lot more in this game. Personally. Is level 18. Let's go. Yeah, no. I feel like I haven't really seen a lot. 7,000 hours. This game just hits so much harder and a little bit only real negative point is a massive FPS trap in the city. Almost feels like a blight town from DS1. Yeah, so I messed with my settings a bit and... Oh, that's a lake or a river. That would have been a poor decision for me to go over there. Um, so I was messing with some settings, and with my PC, I was able I was able to get town to run pretty smoothly. Um, I just changed a couple of things, and it seemed like it was going pretty well. So, is this a challenge arisen to see who can keep pace? No time but to catch your breath. Try to keep up. Seven thousand hours in Dragon's Dogma One is pretty intense. That's a lot of hours. Need to try it. My laptop with the 4070 should be able to handle it perfectly. Yeah. I'll get that for you. What did I hear over here? Done lots of gaming at work. Hey, you know, whatever, whatever works for you, man, for sure. If that's what you can do, send it. Even beat online or dragon solo. That's great. Oh yeah, Phantoms don't like lightning. They get the spooks. So mad that they are challenging me to get the all 240 seeker tokens. Yeah, that's gonna be a that's gonna be a thing. What a punk, he keeps going in and out of his freaking phase. Lots of enemies a bit weakened down. Garms are just big doggos now. Fair enough. It's AC2 all over again. <laughs> with the, yeah, with the collectible stuff. But I mean, at least you get something out of it though. At least there's rewards. Goblins are a real annoyance now. Some are heckin' strong. Yeah, goblins are crazy. And they come out of nowhere, dude. Like, randomly, you'll just be walking around, and then one just yeets himself across the screen and smacks you with his shield. Happens way too often. <laughs> Actually the worst. Yeah, Oz. So, I don't, uh, I don't remember exactly where it was, but there's, uh, there's a little section where you can buy stuff for Seeker Tokens. I think it was at the Pawns Guild, maybe. You think I can make that? Would that such tranquility could last? Hmm. We're gonna try it. Well, we can make it, but can we make it to the other side? Though is the problem. I don't think we can. We might be able to make it down that way. Oh, oh. We might be in a doozy here. Garms are already easy in the first game. I don't know how people are calling them difficult. Uh, I don't actually know what you're talking about with Garms. That doesn't ring a bell for me. It probably should, but it doesn't. Yeah, that looks really far away, but it's also kind of dark, so I don't know. There's definitely no way I'm reaching land over that direction. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, old wager. I say we collect as much as we can carry. Okay. Um. Yeah, we can make it back over this way. Perfect. Perfect. I was hoping I wasn't stuck over there. Once you're over level 100, they're easy. 
Screw Garm, they one hit killed in Bitter Black Isle. Yeah, I still don't know what you're talking about. Sometimes my headset likes to just like cut out the audio, so. Just want to double check that was not the case. That's interesting though about Garms. I don't remember ever seeing one. But. Well, I mean that that would explain it, because to I, I never really got to Bitter Black Isle. This is indeed fine. Absolutely. Yep. But yeah, no, I, <clears throat> I never actually made it to Bitter Black Isle. Um, so what happened was, I probably wouldn't have, well, I mean, I did a little bit, but like, I really never got into like the depths of it. So I ended up getting stuck in the last quest for Dragon's Dogma 1. And so it forced me to go into New Game Plus. Um, and so I couldn't do as much of the end game stuff that I wanted to do in the regular base game. So I have to do a little bit of the Bitter Black Isle stuff, but I only made it to like the first boss, which was the Gore Ogre or whatever. Actually, let me cast this. Heal everybody up. Many thanks. Punk, what you gonna do, huh? I got a shield. You can't do jack. You little prick. He got absolutely clobbered. That was great. <clears throat> yeah, this shield is probably the best spell. For a mage for me. Uh, that's insane. Brother's Crib with the Lurk. Appreciate that Lurk, man. Enjoy. Enjoy your Lurk. Especially because I think you're probably playing the game too. If you exclamation mark Lurk, it'll put the little command in there. It doesn't particularly matter, but that's just if you wanted to. Yeah, there was a third one somewhere. Oh, he leaped right out of that. Thank you. I think that staggered him, which is incredible. Yeah, the shield's super tanky. Love it. <clears throat> yeah, those like hobgoblin looking guys are pretty tanky. You guys got that. There's some silver ore. Is that all? Seems like it. All right, let's restore this for some extra rift credits. Make camp. Yes, modest camping kit. That should be all the enemies in the area, I believe. <clears throat> Let's see if we can cook anything. Rotten. We can cook this. Look at that. Looking real good, huh? Visions of roast meat will dance in my head tonight, for all I've stuffed myself. I quite agree. At best we recuperate our strength before we set <coughs> off again. Yeah, we, uh... Yeah, no, it's it's a video of real meat, yeah. They didn't do any CGI or anything. Can I not uh, interact with this anymore? I okay. am attentive and loyal, and prefer to remain by your side. Okay, well... Yeah, they did they didn't prefer to like do any CGI or like editing, so they just literally put in real life footage of grilling meat. <laughs> I'm for it. It looks cool, so it works. Alright, well as much as I love wandering about at the dark the dark hours, I also like to see. 
so. Ooh, beetle, nice. I really need to look out for those more. I haven't been on the look for them as much as I probably should be. Perhaps fortune has deigned to aid us at last. There's a cyclops just chilling over there. We could probably hit him from over there. And if he walks towards us, he'll probably fall off, so win win. Unless he's already dead. Nah, he's just slouching. Is he just gonna fall off with like physics? It looks like he was kinda just like about to fall off. Do not waste this chance. We must press home our advantage. What is that? What is that? Is that a slime? I have never seen that before. Okay. Interesting. We'll get out of here. Weird jelly. Yeah, you don't like flame, do you? Don't feel very good, does it? Gelatinous not cube. Precisely. Oh, he's struggling. He's struggling. Burn his eye. Burn his eye. No. Oh, well, he's getting back up. Hit those legs. Where are these other two guys? What are they? Why are they all the way over there? What are we? What are we doing here? That's why we can't have nice things. Cause our team's out here dicking around. Bang for channel points. I don't know why it's not coming through. Interesting. Very interesting. I don't actually know if that's still a redeemable, though. It's weird. Because normally that's the first in chat thing. Hmm. That's interesting. Oof. Sorry, guys. I'm working on the shield. <laughs> Mr. Cyclops. Yeah, the shield's super incredible. It's like probably one of my favorite spells in a game like ever. That's insanely cool. It does so much damage while they're down. It's actually insane. Might as well just finish them off because we can. As I understand, it's just We're a little bit on the heavy side. Oh, hello. There's a freaking Drake over there, dude. Um, should we try taking it on? We did just rest a minute ago. Screw it. We're gonna we're gonna test our metal here. It is about time we pressed on, wouldn't you say? There's like a 90% chance I'm not ready for this, but we're gonna do it. We're gonna send it. I don't even care. We're gonna give it. <clears throat> it's fine. If we die, we die. I like trains. <laughs> If this was Skyrim, then it would be fighting, uh, would be fighting our good boy, uh, what's his name? I can't remember his name now. Thomas. That's the one. Thomas the Dank Engine. Oh, 
Oh yeah, you guys are gonna need some healing after that. It does very little damage. I don't know why I just cast a fire spell. That's actually gonna do nothing. Woo! Holy, that did a lot of damage. Hold on. It's fine. Oh, that shield is so good, dude. I should probably be handy. Yeah, probably. You are absolutely not wrong about that. I don't have the high ice spell, though. One tap the Drake. <laughs> yeah, I wish. That'd be incredible. I don't know what this guy's weak spot is. I mean, usually it's their, like, heart area, but I don't see a little thing there in this game. Maybe it's their head now. That's what the American school system uses for all injuries. That's funny. Sucks to be you, don't it, dragon? Dude, that shield is so busted. You can literally just sit there and tank hits. It's incredible. Like, as long as I keep this up, they should be fine. Like, it's insane. You have to hit the chest until the heart's exposed. Gotcha, I gotta get Chester up. You guys will be alright for a second. Still get staggered, but that's fine. gonna be an hour and a half until you drain one health bar <laughs> yeah <laughs> unless i could do some more damage to like the head or something i mean the, the head seems to be a decent weak spot weak spot Just toss it into the water. He, I mean, he might jump into the water. To be honest. That may very well just happen on its own. That shield is so freaking busted, dude. No, oh, I see the heart now. There it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see it now. It wasn't showing before. I wonder if lightning's actually going to do anything to it, though, because it's kind of coming from above instead of below. So I wonder if that's actually going to do anything. Damage the chest till it's exposed. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, burn me, dragon. I dare you. That's right. You can't. Got that fire protection. No, well, okay, I guess I keep looking into witchcraft. Fair enough. Okay, 
I gotta go get Jack. High streets injuries, everything needs some other stuff, yeah. Are you stabbing that foot? Wonder if fire actually does anything to the chest, I doubt it. Yeah, it's like actually doing nothing. I figured it would, but. Oh, 100%. Without this shield, I'd be I'd have been tossed like 10 times over by now. 100%. Can you get out of the way, please? Trying to revive friends here. Give him that shield before he gets landed on. Perfect. Cyclopses can level a forest. Let's give these guys another shield while I get Ace up. That's doing decent damage. That's not doing bad when it hits the heart. One legit smash trees that were to kill me. Yeah, no. I mean, all things considered, I could definitely handle a dragon once I get a little bit more damage. I feel. Oh no, I got silenced. That's not good. Do I have anything to get rid of that? I think I do, right? Maybe. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, maybe I don't. I guess I don't. Well, we might have to dip then. Big oof, actually. And here, all current debilitations. I guess it doesn't really matter, though. I mean... Might be specific and destructible, but generally destructible. Panacea, yeah. Okay, but, like, is it worth... Because <clears throat> we're full health right now. The, the question is, is, would it be worth just... I mean, because realistically, I'm probably not going to kill this dragon. Like, it's going to take forever. We just don't really have the damage. So I think it's going to be best just to dip, honestly. Because, I mean, I, I really would love to take it down, but I, I am actually going to be here for hours, assuming that I can maybe even manage to take it down, which is a big maybe. What the hell was that? You can't sing lightning? Go punk. Are these bandits? I don't know if those are bandits or what. No, those are just a bunch of pawns. Okay, cool. What's that purple stuff? Oh, that's a freaking thing. That's a Saurian. You'll have the damage output to deal with a dragon. If it keeps silencing you, that shield isn't going to save you even I can't deal with a drake and I'm level 22. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see. Might just need a better party, like, composition of higher levels and stuff with more skills. Is probably what we're going to need to be able to take those guys on. I might get attacked because there's a Saurians right there, but... We did not. A good sleep does wonders. Off we go, then. Ready to forge on? I would have preferred you to have to fight so soon, but at least I know I am up to the challenge. I mean, as long as I have panaceas on me, I should be able to keep the silence to a minimum. I'll 
turn you into a That's like a poisonous freaking uh Zarian. Interesting. When I took a hit from the Drake, it was half my health as a fighter. Fighters get the highest armor, so that says something about the might of Drakes, yeah. Well he was he was basically one shotting all of my all of my party members. So Yes, I'm aware of the Brian. Is it really that deep right there? Not compares to the thrill of victory. One cannot help but feel indomitable. Well, I'm sure there's still room for improvement. Yes, so. That's fine. Okay, so what level are we now? We're level 18, and our pawns are level 16. So while we're here, I guess we could top off on some pawns. Get a couple extras. Feed enemies to the brine to sate their gluttony. <laughs> well, hey, I mean, we already had a griffin dunk himself for a drink earlier, so that worked out. That did work out. <clears throat> I wish you could keep like a permanent filter of like two levels above you. So that way like or like it would be two levels above where you last were, I guess. I don't know. But like just so that way it could just call in a certain like um phones in the rift. Oh wait, so can I not search here? Do I have to go do I have to go to a specific spot? No, it didn't die. I, I left because it was going to take too long. I didn't have enough stuff to really deal with it at the moment. Unfortunately. I probably could have made it work, but it would have taken a really, really long time. We may have to wait till we get back to town because this is just a small rift. I don't think we can actually call certain things here. Interesting. I mean, we could probably stock up on a slightly better one, but I'm not really terribly worried about it, I guess. That's what's going to be the case. I'd say we collect as much as we can carry. Also, it seems like fairy stones are pretty rare. At least from I've only found one, I think. <clears throat> I may just not be looking in the right places, but that is very possible. They've gotten a total of three. Yeah, considering like considering that they're quantity based, though, that's kind of terrible. Like, cause you only get one use out of them, so you only get three chances to be able to go back anywhere at any given time. Like, you really need that for, like, a rainy day kind of a thing at, at, at those quantities. Because three is definitely not going to be enough to get you where you need to go. In a pinch. No, oh, it's this freaking thing again. Oh, golly. Get out of here, punk. Anymore, the devs wanted us to explore and see the world instead of just fast traveling everywhere. Yeah. Honestly, I I would be surprised if they didn't add it back in at some point. To be honest with you, like maybe if they have like a like a DLC, I'd be shocked if they didn't add it at that point. Because then at that point it would just be kind of more of a convenience thing. You know what I mean? Like, because everyone by that point has probably explored most of the map by the time they get out like a DLC. So it would be more of like a, a big oof to just have to keep, you know, walking everywhere and seeing the same stuff you've already seen. Not that the game isn't pretty or anything, but like, you know, you can only see a place so many times before it starts to get dull. Yeah, for sure. I mean, honestly, here's the thing. Like, I I would I would be fine if they added it as like a DLC, like whenever that launches, because it's like, like I said, at that point in time, like most people have probably already explored the game, you know, like not necessarily maybe from people complaining, but just like 
as a DLC item, so that way you can kind of get around the main base game map, and then you can kind of explore the DLC and stuff as well at a at a decent pace. Who knows when it's actually going to come out and all that. Yeah. That's kind of the thing about games that, that sucks these days, is like... It's it's definitely a consumer based product because you know there's there's a mass amount of consumers that are consuming the product, but at the end of the day it's also art, which a lot of people forget. Port crystal warp location marker. So um that's not DLC for like it's a it's a little microtransaction that allows you to place a marker on the map. So you can place the marker on the map and fast travel to said marker, but that doesn't give you the item to travel to the marker. The item to travel, which is the fairy stones, are the the more precious item in question. The map is incredibly massive. Take a chance to zoom out and pan around the map. It's probably going to be a long time until we see any DLC. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> a lot of it's just for convenience, Anomaly. Like, a lot of the microtransactions in this game are... They're just convenience stuff. Like, they're just for the player that doesn't, you know doesn't want to go and find port crystals and stuff and wants to just buy for them or, or pay for them rather Product. that'll do some good damage There you go, Jack. There's another shield for you, my good sir. We'll get Ace up. Too bad you can't hit me with a shield on, punk. Get out of here. Get out of here. Raid incoming. Hey, Bones. How's it going, Toke? How you doing? Since I played this game, I'm finding it hard to understand the concept. That's why I'm asking these questions. Heck yeah, Togue, absolutely. We're getting Our a 24-hour stream going on. Each of us is suited to a I think the port crystal task. microtransaction unlocks all the built-in port crystals so you don't have to find and touch them. No great shock to me. Um, I don't think it does. I think so. I think there's a there's a port crystal in towns and stuff, and then there's a port crystal that's supposed to be portable like the first one. And I think you could just buy extra portable ones for wherever you want to place them. At least that's what I understand the DLC to be. I could be wrong, but that's what I got out of the description. Might have come over a little bit too early, Toad. <laughs> Did some major exploration. That's what's up. Heck yeah. That's awesome. Incredible. Sorry for ruining the raid. <laughs> yeah, Toad uh, Tog was a little bit early, but that's okay. Please tell you, say mischief managed after the stream. That's funny. Lost your food supply? Oh man, that's a bummer. It happens though. That is one of those things in those games that tends to happen. Thank you, I feel much better. Oh, okay. We're going down. Where did he end up? Right there. Team Hufflepuff for the win. Maybe I should. <laughs> Absolutely. That's awesome. Send it. Get out of here, dude. You're bamboozling me for far too long. Heal up. 
for Greg soup. <laughs> he was eating legs and arms. Oh man. The cannibalism at its finest. I mean, it's it's pretty easy to get into that when it comes to uh, when it comes to the forest. It's uh, it's very ample in supply. You have a cannibal in your camp. You gotta watch out. It might get a little dangerous. Might have to sleep with one eye open. That looks promising. Any ideas as to how we might reach it? Oh well, if I was I'm just a little off. From this distance, I'll Calling call request. Sure. We shall have to make our way over to it. What's in the goodie box? Best me on the game and gives buff, so win-win, absolutely. I'd have to concur with that statement. A friendly one. <laughs> Mess around and find out. Got a lot of pew-pews now. Hey, there you go. At least you have a defense mechanism. That's the important part, I think. I guess I don't really need to cast that right now. Those freedom seeds. <laughs> That's great. That's incredible. Wait, what? Why is there? A, there's still a marker here for some reason. Here you are. Something. Something for my troubles, huh? Okay, I'll take fifty gold and some supplies. Help. Sure. We're exploring. <clears throat> the games are great tonight. So, um, I decided that we're going to try to do a 24-hour. So, we are at hour 5 right now. So, we still have 19 hours to go. At least that's the plan. But they are, they're going well. They're going well. We're having a great time. We're having good conversations. So, you know, can't complain. Some wolves over there. What are you guys attacking over there? Do I ever sleep? Yes, I do. I do sleep. I, I tend to find myself being up longer than I should most nights. Because what'll happen is, like, I'll end stream, and then I'll just hang out forever, usually. Or if I'm not hanging out in the raid after stream, I'm doing something. Like, I, I'm always just chilling here, anyways. <laughs> Afterwards, I just, I always end up just doing a whole bunch of nothing for hours. I do sleep eventually, but it tends to take some time. I got a couple of energy drinks as well, ready, if we uh, if we ever need them. I'm hoping not to, but uh, we'll see. Not done the 24 hour yet. That's fair. I've done a, I've done a few, not like streamed ones, but I've done I've done a few. It's been a while since I've actually done one, but the stream for 23 hours, 15 minutes, and the stream is gonna crash. You'll have to start over. <laughs> At that point, then we're just we're just gonna say it's 24 hours and we'll call it good. If we're one minute off the 24 hour, absolutely calling it good there. There's no reason not to at that point. He's getting absolutely wrecked. Let's get those shields back on, yes. Doing that lately too. Staying up afterwards, yeah. I don't know what it is. I just, uh, I can't. I can't, uh, sleep at normal times like I should be, so I just stay up. A moment of decision may spill out. It happens. Been up for 21 hours, yeah. One minute is okay to call it, but two minutes? That's a lawsuit, good sir, I dare say. The title promised me that in 24 hours. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. 
seems a little suspicious. There's no, there's no binding terms. <laughs> We were overconfident in our abilities. It is a painful reminder. We should be What's in the goodie box? Ooh, a wakestone shard. I kind of feel like so that was see what happens. not the best thing. Ooh, there's a button here. Oh no, there's a secret token. Oh, okay. I'll take that. Oh, there's a griffin. Would you look at that? Is that his nest over there? I kind of want to investigate now. Kind of have to investigate now. There's rocks. He went down. He dove. We're gonna have to check it out. Big white eyes. <laughs> so it's 2 a.m. right now for me. In let's see, nine in about nine hours from now, I'll have been awake for 24 hours straight, but not streaming for 20 hours or 24 24 hours straight. So it'll be a long few hours. Ooh, this is a Griffin's nest. Okay, so maybe this punk's not gonna leave. We found the nest, peeps. No, oh, we're gonna absolutely destroy this guy. Come here, punk. Ain't gonna abandon that nest, will you? I doubt it. Oh, it's a secret token. Nice. If stream does crash, I refer to my previous statement. The. <laughs> Ooh, what is this? Griffin pinion? Come here, guys. You can make it, I believe. Just hop down. I'll heal you. Hopefully. Might head to bed, Asmund, for sure. Do what you gotta do, man, if you're tired. Absolutely. Get that rest. I will not blame you. You have fun with that? I know, they totally abandoned me. They just completely just dipped. And the griffin also dipped. The griffin doesn't even want to be here. Well, that was a waste of time. Oh, hey, he's got a port crystal and a fairy stone. Ooh, nice. And a lot of money, holy. Well, this is great. I get free loot. Well, I mean, I, I just get a loot as his house. That's fine. I'm down for pillaging. Griffin said, screw those kids. You can have them. <laughs> yeah, F them kids. You can you can have my... Oh, now you guys want to be here. Okay, well, where the hell did the Griffin go? Dude, the, the Griffin even said F his own nest, dude. Oh, there he is. Gonna get ready to lay down. Sounds good, Lady Mischief. I appreciate that raid, though. Thank you so much for coming in and bringing the community over. It's always a pleasure. I'll have to, I'll have to catch another one of your streams soon. For sure. I definitely appreciate you coming in, though. It is always, always a good time. Yeah, they seem a little derpy. Talk about buttered sauce is where it comes from, what it does. Why is it doing what it's doing? Get it out of my face. Yep. Absolutely. You gotta get the sausage. Sausage on the menu. Alright, come here, punk. Come here, punk. Oh, we're a ghost streamer now, huh? Very, very nice. Oh, you're getting toasted today. We're getting roast bird. There's still far more. Oh, yeah, 100%. Uh, Toke, there is no friendly fire, no. So you can roast away all day. Gojo's lol where? <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't hear no Gojo. I think Oz is just hearing what they want to hear at this point. We're back. Welcome back to the land of the living, people. Ow. Oh, 
he's going ham. We need some shields up in here. Make him bacon? Absolutely. Griffin bacon. Let's get our roast on. Let's get some roast griffin. Roast him. Thank you. Appreciate that pawn. Oh yeah, this guy's absolutely getting destroyed in his own nest. See, when he has nowhere to go, he's just he's just a small Tiny griffin that can't do much. Get your heels, Ace. Me over, but that's okay. Come on. There we go. A little bit of roasting. Got you guys a shield. I'm out of stamina though, for a second. Get another shield going because he's got been hit. Guys are fighting against bosses or regular mobs. Um, technically this could be considered a boss. Yeah. They're just like random world bosses to a degree, I would say. Like random, like, so randomly you can encounter things like with big health bars. Like at the top of the screen, you can see that there's like that pinkish purplish health bar thing. Um, that I would consider like a mini health, like a, a mini boss battle. Come here, Ace, I got you. If I can res you, holy smokes. But yeah, for the most part, everything else is mostly just regular mobs. Get some heals going on. I wonder if lightning does anything. Because that will definitely strike him. Doesn't really do much damage. Fire is definitely better. Come on, buddy. You know you want to get roasted. Appreciate you, Chester. There we go. There's another health bar down. As long as we can get them down like this, they go down real quick. It's just a matter of getting them down like this. There's like, there's burst phases, really. Is essentially what I would call it, honestly. this. Chester, I got you with some heals. So you deal most damage to heads? Sometimes. There's definitely different weak points on, on different mobs. For this mob, you want to aim fire at the wings, mostly. Because if you can hit fire on the wings, it'll, it'll knock them over, and it'll prevent them from flying. That's ideal. Alright, let's get Ace back up here. 
can't do nothing to me, bird. I got a shield. Also, what is this smog down here? Not really the biggest fan of whatever this is. PS5, the ping noise comes through the controller speaker. It's an annoyance. Oof, that is an annoyance. Okay, we need to rush because I was messing up some controls there. We should be able to get a bar down, though. There we go. There's a bar. It is so dark in this little section. I kind of want to move him back up here if I can help it. I mean, it is nighttime now, so it's going to be kind of dark just everywhere, but... Oh, did he fall over again? Oh, we need to take advantage of that for sure. Roast him. Get some cooked griffin. If we can completely destroy the wings, it would solve the flying problem, yeah. Like, if you can tatter them to the point where they couldn't fly, 100%. That'd be ideal. Let's get some roasted wing going on. We should be getting close to getting burnt wings. Lighting them on fire. That should be enough to destroy them. Oh, yeah, 100%. The game doesn't have that specific mechanic, Togue, no. So, you can, uh, you can hit the wings. And it'll bring them down for a time, but it'll never permanently destroy the wings. I'm saved. Thank you, Arisen. Those blue eyes glowing in the dark is so cool. I don't actually know if that's still where he's even at. I can't really see. Base is up there. Knock him down. Ooh, got him. Nice. Let's burn him. Yeah, I'm gonna take advantage of this damage. And then I gotta get this guy up before his bar runs out, because we definitely need another person. You can't destroy them completely. Probably fought Griffins as many times as you still have managed to kill when they keep flying away. Gotcha. Yeah, that's annoying. I'm glad I was able to stumble upon the nest, because that's really the only reason I'm able to take this guy out as much as I am right now. Because he literally just won't leave his nest. There he goes. Now he's got burnt wings. Yeah, when they've got burnt wings like that, they, they won't go anywhere. <clears throat> Toast that noggin. Heal up a bit. Get another shield going. Had one down to about five percent. Yeah. I don't. I don't think he'll leave. Like I said, he's at his nest. I. I would highly doubt that he'd leave. I mean, you're not wrong. It still could be a possibility, but I. I would doubt it. Let's 
burn those wings. We're basically a battle mage at this point, which is great. We don't really have like melee, but we can we can tank all these hits with this ability. <clears throat> I'm so glad they added speed casting for stamina usage. That's incredible. Oh, we're gonna finish. I think it's hilarious that a griffin earlier just decided to take a dip in some water and mop himself for me. That was incredible. Incredibly lucky. getting roasted now. Hold on, do we have any stamina? I want to keep plunging this real quick. Yeah, we do. You said it did by... It died. No, 100%. It, it face-dived into the water and 100% died. Yeah, no, it died. Yeah, you get loot. So when you when you take down big bosses like this, you'll usually get loot um, that's good for leveling up your stuff. Yeah, you don't get a lot. I mean, I am level 20 now, but it's definitely is not as much as it could have been. Yeah, we got the griffin down. Ingredients to be gathered here or griffin down. We could pick some now and use them when the need arises. Oh, there's a zombie here. Well, good thing I've got my shield, eh? It's roasty toasty time. Now you need to get a phoenix down. Is there phoenixes in this game? Or are you talking about a specific phrase? Gotcha. I understand it in that uh, in that context. I just wasn't sure if you were actually talking about like a physical phoenix. Ooh, a chest. Oh, that's a ghost warrior thing. Ow, hold on. Yeah, get away from me, punk. Okay, fire's not really doing much to him. Oh, I think he fell just now. Great. He sure did. Like an idiot. Oh, I didn't see that guy. Where's our homeboy down at? Ace is over here. Okay. How did he get over the all the way over here? What are you doing all the way over here? I guess he's getting attacked by a mage. That makes sense. Oh, I tried. Damn it. Come on, let me get him. Come on. I could still do it, potentially, if this ghost leaves me alone. Yeah, I think we can still get it. Good enough. I'll take it. Ow, that hurt. These skeletons are no joke, dude. There we go. We can get this guy back up. Get more shields going on. This is horrible. We need holy light so bad right now. The product of heedlessness. You'll have to manage on your own. I've got my hands full. 
Oof. All right, come on, stamina, you can do it, I believe. Oh, you punk, you would freaking dash attack me. Where's my other pawn? Got it from Mildred, she's the best. Hey, there you go. Right, we need to get Ace back up. All right, get out of here, you stupid skeleton. All right, I guess my other pawn's just toast. I don't even know what happened to him. These skeletons are brutal, man. Dude, the fact that they have so many wombo combos is terrible. Like, you get stun locked, and I absolutely hate that. Like, if there's more than one enemy hitting you at a time, you're basically dead. I played Airhorn, but it didn't play. Interesting. I don't know why it didn't. You're on the right. We're on the right scene and everything. Interesting. I don't know why that's not playing. Did it mute it by chance? Hold on. Let me let me look at that real quick. Uh, no. Everything should be working. I don't understand why that's not interesting. Um, do. Yeah, everything should be working. I don't know why I just decided not to. Weird. That's a uh, sound alert, huh? Let's check it out real quick. Yeah, it should be on. Hmm. I guess it decided it didn't want to hang out today. Oh, now that wants to play sound. Gonna have to go get off. Scared of an autosave right before a power outage? Yeah. That wouldn't be good. Lose all your stuff. That'd be terrible. Yeah, lightning is the best on them, but it's not great. Fire doesn't really seem to do much of anything. Skeletons suck, dude. Tell you what. I also don't know where Jack went. He kind of just died, I guess. That sucks. Okay. It's taking every ounce of your strength just to remain safe. Oh, nice. I don't know how that guy got crushed so quickly, but I'll take it. Yeah, we need to head to camp soon for sure. Ace is about spent. Yeah, that hardly did anything. I mean, he was blocking. Those guys give decent XP, which is nice. But they're kind of a pain. I don't know about superb, it was just one skeleton. But if you want to get excited about it, I won't say no. That hurt. I don't even feel like... Well, I guess that was kind of a far fall. It looked a lot shorter in the dark. The fire misled me. Oh, there's... Something spooky going on here. Oh. What do you got shooting at? Oh, I see. A spirit, eh? 
You got almost pulled? Yeah. Those guys are so easy to deal with with lightning. Absolutely destroys them. We've earned ourselves a pat on the back. We mustn't allow us. The only thing I don't really have is holy damage. And that does not do anything to skeletons other than that. So we really need holy damage for those guys. I didn't mean to heal myself. Let's get some roasting going on. Okay, that didn't do much for us. Let me get Ace back up. Ooh, Chester is down. These bandits are a pain, tell you what. Oof. Okay, well, I can't withstand that many attacks. <clears throat> okay, these bandits are a pain. The freaking, of course, I ran into insanely strong bandits all of a sudden. When we're just in the worst possible position. Gosh dang it. Yeah, that figures. Not much I could do, but run, because I, I can't dish out much damage, unfortunately. And I'm heavy, which also doesn't help my stamina problem. Can you guys get, like, possessed by a ghost? That'd be incredible. Dude. Dick. Oh, of course there's a skeleton this way. There would be. We're just running into all sorts of issues, huh? Wow, what a shocker. He ran and caught up to me. Freaking skeletons, man. Concern it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly. Damn it. I literally can't do anything right now. I literally can't get anything off, even with the fastest rush spell. I just need to see if I can dip. Even though that's not looking very likely. Yeah, and I'm gonna get absolutely clobbered right now. Yep. Okay. We might still be able to get out of it. We'll see. Just maybe. If our luck lines up. Being heavy does not help, though. Does not help at all. That was such a terrible canyon. I did not have anything prepared for those skeletons. And there's wolves. That's the last thing I need right now. Dude, go away, wolf. Why can't you guys just, like, fight each other for once? Like, you guys are literally enemies of each other, too. Like, leave me alone. For, like, literally just, like, two seconds, man. Calm down. Okay. Well, you guys literally are just horde piling onto me right now. I don't lose everything if I go... In. It's just... I. It's just I don't know where the checkpoint's gonna bring me when it decides that it wants to last save me is the problem. Turn 
Oh, and of course, this bandit decides to come up on the stupid mountain. These bandits are terrible, man. Screw these guys. This is awful. Nah, this is super annoying, to be honest. This is really freaking annoying. I mean, I probably could just die and, like, go a different route, but then I'm still stuck in the canyon. The, the whole objective of this is to get the hell out of that canyon. But it's not looking likely like that's really even going to happen. We're just getting lower and lower health until we're probably just not going to be able to do anything at all. And, of course, our stamina is just completely burnt. So I'm going to die again. Even though our stamina should be regenerating while we're down, because I'm not running. Game runs smoothly yesterday, but it takes like 100% and like 2 FP can I do anything to improve it. So, I'll show you my settings here in a second after I stop getting bullied, if that ever happens, which probably won't. Yeah, literally the second I get up, I'm just completely grabbed again and bombarded by another attack. This is, this is pretty stupid. I should probably just let this go, but I'm kind of stubborn. Literally one shot by literally anything, and I'm just getting absolutely clobbered. This is really annoying. Hey, Beef Borrower, welcome in. How you doing? Um, I'd say this game is worth it. Yeah, for sure. A lot of people are saying it's not because of uh, microtransactions and stuff, but, I mean, the core gameplay loop of this game is fun. I would say it's enough to be worth it. This probably lands me in some water. Sure does. Okay, can you just, like, jump into the water? Are you guys finally done harassing the crap out of me? What are my food plans? I don't have food plans. I'm just gonna do whatever happens. If you need microtransactions this game, maybe you don't play it. Water your best friend? Uh, apparently not. I don't know how these guys aren't dying. They're completely submerged in water. Does this fully heal me? I have three of these. I might as well see. Yeah, that fully heals me and restores my health, so that's kind of nice. I don't know how well that's going to help our situation. Yeah, I'm getting real sick of you guys. And my stamina is just instantly out after one single cast. Oof. Um, that cures me of all debilitations, but that's not really worth using at the moment. I do want to use this. Yeah, not really worth using at the moment. So, <clears throat> microtransactions are just little transactions that are like a couple of dollars. Um, here and there that are just like little convenience items for the most part, or like things that will typically, uh, make the game a little bit easier for you, like, mildly. Like, for this game specifically, like, you can buy port crystals and stuff. Oof. Well, that's gonna kill me. Oh my god. Okay. Screw this. We're just gonna go back to the last save. This is just too much of a pain in the butt at this point. We've gone through so many resources just to have them keep freaking ragdolling us. This is annoying. This is just a bad freaking area. I was not, I did not have anything for this. Plus the fact that that griffin took so freaking long and my pawns were just absolutely wrecked. So the microtransactions are just convenience for like traveling around the map. Cause so for the fast travel in the game, um, there's these little port crystals and stuff. Um, and a lot of people, uh, a lot of people are complaining about that, even though that's stuff you can get in the game. Um, the, there's two other things, two other main things that a lot of people are complaining about as well. And that is that, uh, no harm in picking a few. there is, um, there's no way to start like a new game. So if you, if you make your character <clears throat> and you don't like, like a certain aspect of them, you have to wait until you get a character edit voucher to like basically recreate them. Otherwise you can't start a brand new game, um, without having to, uh, do that. 
So it's kind of one thing people aren't liking. But most of the people that are complaining about that have barely started the game. And they probably just didn't take the time to, like, actually, to you know, side. create their character. In battle, I shall so. follow your lead and prioritize support. 22, huh? Arisen details, Capcom. Oh, so Capcom made this guy, huh? Interesting. How many credits? 68? Hmm. Hmm. Sure. Well, no, we're kind of in a bad spot. We might just dip back to the one place. Uh, the other issue is the uh, the anti-cheat software. Uh, a lot of people don't like De Novo, or De Novo, or however the hell you say it. A lot of people don't like that. Could Are we all in the same boat? You're soaked. Do you try not to catch cold? Yeah, I get punked on. Now that I know you guys are just camping here, basically, I can actually prepare for this a bit better. But yeah, it's only solo. So as far as the microtransactions, like there, there isn't really a like a necessity to buy any of them. They're just more minor convenience things. But the uh, not being able to start a new game is kind of weird. I don't know why they didn't have that. To be honest, it's kind of like a basic feature of a lot of games. That one I don't really understand on their part. But everything else is just minor convenience stuff. Forgive me for being a burden arisen. So. Speak your will, and I'll see it done. Chill out, Chester. Just make the game offline, or do you need any anti-cheat? Well, the thing about it is, even if it is... Well, technically, the game is offline, for the most part. The only thing that's really online... <clears throat> the only thing that's really online about the game is the uh, pawn system, where you can get other people's pawns and stuff. So, I mean, technically, you could get, like, hacked items through there. But like the reality of that happening is is it's taking probably not likely. Of my strength just to remain standing. Will this march never end? You're not the only one. But I mean for the for the most part this is an offline game otherwise. Yeah, get out of here you freaking wolves. That's for bullying me 2 seconds ago. A bunch of pricks. So the anti and it's it's not really a dumb question. It's just one of those things where it's like anti cheat people feel a specific way about. So the the specific anti cheat that they're talking about, which is Denuvo, is is one that has historically apparently affected like PC performance and stuff like that. Because it's a PC only thing. Like you're not gonna see that on console. Um, but as far as that goes, like, the anti-cheat software itself seems to have caused, like, performance issues, and it may be causing performance issues with this game. Personally, I've been able to adjust my settings to where I haven't had really many issues with performance, so I don't really see the problem there, personally. Um, but again, I haven't been on PC for, like, a really long time, so I can't specifically say whether, like, I've experienced, you know, any sort of issues with it myself, if I'm being 100% honest. And then the other part of the uh, the thing is, from what I understand, essentially, like, if something were to happen, like, when you buy a license through Steam, and Denuvo owns, like, they own, like, the online portions of the game, essentially, if anything ever happens to where it, like, goes offline later down the road, like, many years in the future, you essentially won't have access to the game anymore. But as far as I know, I haven't heard of that ever happening. So, <clears throat> I don't know. Thank you so much for that follow, Beef Borrow. I appreciate that. I do appreciate that. Welcome into the Moose Crew. Hope you enjoy your stay. How's it going, crazy? Kind of went on a bit of a tangent, but... Off we go, then. How you been? Playing some more Helldivers, or are you taking a break still? Oh, this is where this ended up, huh? Okay, so we ended up back at square one. Gotcha. Okay, well, that was a massive pain in the butt for basically no reason. F bandits, man. These guys suck, like, super hard. You guys are the freaking worst. 
Yeah, once we're at full health and stuff and like the party composition's good, then yeah. So for my PC specs, I have a uh, 4060 um, NVIDIA graphics card, uh, 4060 Ti. And then for my CPU, I have a Ryzen 7 7700. Uh, I think, I want to say 8 core processor. That may not 100% be accurate, but I want to say that. So I have I have more than enough as far as uh, hardware to handle this game. Okay, there's nothing. There's no way to get over that. Good to know. And then I have uh, 16 gigs of RAM. So I have I have the minimum as far as RAM. I would like to increase that at some point, but it it's you know it works for now. It's not the biggest issue at the moment. So I, I have I have no complaints as far as that goes. But those are the main specs that I have. As far as like my my actual computer, there's a chest over there, huh? Well, don't mind if I do. <clears throat> yeah, I was probably being stubborn earlier for like basically no reason, but that's just how I am, I guess. Got next gen PC, yeah. Welcome in, Casey. How we doing? How we doing? Hope your day's going great so far. Ooh, some dose panacea. I'll take it. Reward for a rigorous search. I don't know about fitting. I would have taken money for some rift credits or something. AM5 socket. I am not sure. I've just had a thought. I'll be honest. Every master I've ever served has Is that a different freaking time. dragon? One party I joined consisted only of ranged specialists. Yeah, that's another dragon. I have no means to deal with that right now. But yeah, I'm I'm not the best. Oh, you came in from uh, Lady. Gotcha. Yeah, I uh, I, I'm not the best in terms of like PC information. I'll I'll be completely upfront about that. Like, and I know for the most part what's in my PC and stuff like that. But like, if we're to get into like technical stuff, nah, I couldn't. I couldn't hang with a conversation like that. I was reading the newer motherboards aren't designed to have four DDR R5 RAM cards running at the same time. Yeah, I'm. I'm not 100% sure. Like I said, when it comes to like tactical stuff like that, that is not something I'm very knowledgeable about. I'll be honest. <clears throat> yeah, it does seem like there's some figuring out to do with that. I'll be for sure. Thank you. Noon bloom. I'll take those. Okay, well, uh, we can't handle the Valley of the Drakes over there, so we can head up this way. It looks like there's a fort over here. I should probably actually use that beetle, too, so we can hold some more stuff. Oh, I have two. Nice. That's 0.3 extra weight. Yeah, we can hold quite a bit now with the two rings plus all the beetles we've used. Well, welcome to the PC realm. Yeah, it's nice. I like it. It's nice that you can virtually play everything. Like, what I've really enjoyed is, like, being able to play my PlayStation as well. Like, because I, I, ma I mainly come from PlayStation, to be honest with you. Um, and I can just use remote play. It's not the best, but I can use it from time to time when I need to. Yeah, I'm enjoying it. Oh, you like that punk? Get a healing going on. Get another shield going on. System is the AM4 socket, but you got the next gen socket. Gotcha.
Yeah, I mean, I wanted to, I wanted to get something that would be, uh, that would be good for quite a while. That way, I didn't really have to worry about too much upgrading. Like, obviously, I can if I need to, but uh, I, I wanted to get something that would last. So, that was kind of the goal. Hold fast, Arisen. I will be with you in but a moment. We probably should go snag another pawn, but kind of adventuring right now. And we're doing okay for the most part. Like, as long as we don't run into something stupid like we did just a minute ago, then we'll be alright. Differing vocation, don't we? I'll wager I could make that shot. Go right ahead. You're tall as shit, dude. Is this a beast? Yep, sure is. Kinda... My talents lie in combining materials. 20? And I'll use those in my possession to craft things Lost for you zero. in my spare time. I think I think I am level twenty now, huh? Are you fit to travel? Then sure, we'll add we'll add a rogue to the party. Why not? Yeah, we're level twenty. Perfect. That works out. Ace is the only one under leveled now. That's fine though. We're fine with that. Avoid fame oh. at any cost, Arisen. You could be doused in oil. Yeah, that works out. Beat the Cyclopses in the northern part before Roman and starting gear. Nice. Heck yeah. That's what's up. Oh, he ran real quick. He said, nope. I'm going to throw a heal on you guys. Top you up. Ooh, that's gonna get a double perfect i mean it didn't kill the other guy but we we got him about half it's nice that you can run into pawns just like on on the journey so you don't really like have to do anything specific we mustn't allow like to go back and get new pawns and stuff take each trial as it comes even if the four sticks added up to 16 gigs hmm. yeah that, that would be an interesting question for sure Where are you trying to lead me, Ace? I see our goal has changed. I would not presume to direct our course, but do let me know if you require a guide. The Arisen is capricious indeed. But don't despair. We shall count upon your guidance when the time comes. Yeah, I don't really want to go back to the main town at the moment. We're still adventuring. And I don't think we have anything as far as like a time quest that we have to deal with, so. Oh, he's blocking. What a punk. <laughs> yeah, I don't see why they would downgrade anything like that. Like, I don't see why they would downgrade to not be able to handle four if they've been able to do it for su like such a long time as it was. But... That's just my perspective, personally. Your pack, well, let's see. What? Actually, yeah, that's a good idea. We're both pretty dang heavy. I wonder if, like, if I ended up going and giving them certain things, like if, like, we ended up dying or something, like, or they ended up dying, like one of the pawns that I gave stuff to, would they just, like, take it back with them? Or would they also just give it back once they're good? It's kind of an interesting question. Discard. Grapes. Discard. We don't need that. We have so much crap on us. I really genuinely need to get some other stuff going. We do Different than the M5. That's why so many people get it confused. Don't know nothing about nothing. Oh, it's one of those freaking ogres. Such single-mindedness makes our enemy addictive. 
You know, it's doing a pretty good amount of damage. Bars already almost down. Gonna throw down a healing pool just in case. I should probably just use my mouse to click that. throw a shield on Ace, so that way she can recover a bit. We must not give them a chance to recover. I shall lead the charge! Thank you. I am in your debt. Full recovery. Get the shields. Oh, now there's a caravan here. That's great. You know, we could use this caravan to go back to the main city if it's heading that way. This wouldn't be a bad time because we get a decent amount of XP, so this wouldn't necessarily be a bad time to go back and check in. This is perfect opportunity to roast him. What does it do when it does boot properly? Ooh, nice. Good stuff, guys. Good stuff. I'm stumped. Nice. Oh, did that cart dip? Oh, he totally did. Come back here. Hold on. The sight of Yonok's cart has brought all my fatigue to the fore. Shall we climb aboard? See well, just a shim. Mm -hmm. found in the main road. Okay, where's this cart going? This ox cart's bound for Vern. I'll not Vern. take you anywhere till I've had my due. Sure, we'll head there. Why not? We'll go to town. Those off. Perfect. Unless we get attacked, which I'm hoping we don't. Paying for it and then getting attacked is like a spit in the freaking face. Alright, see you, dude. Thanks for the ride. You're too slow for me now. Perfect. It's going back to the main town. It's where we needed to go. I keep thinking like we're trying to go back to Grand Soren, but that's from the first game. Shall we see if we can't make our way over to it? Whew, yeah. Gotta offload some stuff, especially our materials. That's a big one. And then we can do some upgrading. You will soon forget the fatigue of a long journey when Orphans. treated to the full deposit. See, we had like half of our, almost half our weight in just materials, which is crazy. Oh, these are valuables, so we just, what, sell these? Well, I'm not going to sell my secret tokens, because I do need those for other things, but... I could just sell most of these books.
utmost hospitality. Let me withdraw these. Jeweled prize, use a protective charm. Okay, so because I could sell those. You know where to find me. These writings could be of import. Shall we take a could closer? Could be of import. Huh? Ooh, what does this guy sell? Interested in my wares? <clears throat> Kinda. Interesting. Only usable by a main pawn at camp. Its mysterious scent gives the pawn a different inclination and a voice to match. Gotcha. Okay. I see. Oh. The art of metamorphosis is only 500 rift credits? That's pretty cheap. Ooh, there's glasses. Okay, we're gonna have to... Is there... Is there any... Hold on. Cancel. Nose pinchers. Half frames. We're gonna have to get Chester some. Yeah, absolutely. We're gonna have to get Chester some. Yeah, he needs some glasses. I do have a pre-built PC. Yeah. I did not go... So, I had... So, I actually got my wife a PC as well. Um... And I ended up going through somebody who builds PCs and stuff like that. Um, and it was a little bit cheaper. Um, but the thing I didn't like about it was there was some things that they did on there that just were like convenience things. Like there wasn't, uh, there was no Wi-Fi card, which wasn't a big deal. I had it, I have it hardwired anyways, but, um, it's just a lot of the convenience stuff you miss out on when you're, when you're doing stuff like that. Like I could, I could probably add that stuff when I, when I build my own PC, but like I said, it's just one of those things where I'd rather not. Makes it easier. Have you business with the guild, sir? So I've, I've tried it both ways. I prefer pre-built personally, but it's just the minor convenience stuff that I prefer. I mean, it's definitely a little bit more expensive, 100%. But weapon skills, spell hold, temporarily stores an enchanted spell in the staff to be cast instantly at the welder's discretion. Slows stamina recovery while storing. Consumes increased stamina when casting. Uh, that sounds pretty interesting, but, eh, 2,000 for this? Okay, high celerity. What does this do again? I don't remember what this does. That's, that's, okay, gotcha. Are slimes only weak to magic? I don't know, I haven't fought slimes with melee, so... In other games, I know slimes can only be hurt by, like, fire and stuff, so... Could be. Augments. Do we have any other augments? We could get intervention. Reduces the duration of debilitations you're afflicted with. That's pretty nice. We have enough. We might as well purchase it. Melee does not work out well? Yeah. 100%. What conveniences? Oh, gotcha. Um, so, like, the other conveniences that I'm talking about is just, like... Whenever... So, and this may not be, like a big issue it's just the person that we went through specifically to build the pc um it didn't have any like in like built-in speakers or anything like that and for my wife she doesn't really use like a headset or anything like that so that was kind of a big thing for her um because there was no speakers in the actual pc itself or the uh the monitor and then uh like i said the wi-fi card there wasn't a bluetooth card or a bluetooth like receiver thing um so you couldn't connect bluetooth devices and then some of the programs that they had on there were kind of weird. Like there isn't a traditional like sound panel. It's like this real tech audio crap that's garbage. And I'm not really a fan of it, to be honest. Um, and again, that could have just been the person I went through um, 100%. But I, I don't know if that's if that's the case with some of those things that would be missing. Like if you were to build your own. But that's just my experience so far. Um, I just, I don't really see, what does Haladum do? Okay, I could buy this, because then it would probably upgrade into something else, I'd assume. Hi, Haladum, yeah, hold on. <clears throat> Extended duration. Okay, so it is nice for getting rid of certain things, but I mean, if we're not getting hit with things in the first place with the uh, ability, then I don't really see much of a point. Try 
try and put four very fast DDR5 cards in there. AM5 won't start, but they need to go to their BIOS and set their I think the CPU can't handle the RAM speed, depending on how good quality the CPU you personally have. Yeah, that could be the case. Spellhold. See, Spellhold seems okay. But it's just like, I don't know when I'd ever use that. And plus, it takes up a slot. So I'd have to get rid of one of my current buffs for something else, which I don't know about that. Hmm. Core skills. We have all the core skills. We have most of this. I might as well get this because it's, it's so cheap. Essentially the CPU boggy's performance or whatever the term is. Yeah, bogs, bogs performance down, yeah. I kind of want to get this for dragons because this might be pretty good against dragons. I'm going to buy it. Because I, I don't really use Argent Tonic too much. And if I can have all three elements, then I can essentially... Unless there's... Uh, unless there's whole, Well, I guess there is Holy. I don't know about Dark, but... At least we have some stuff to be able to deal with them. I feel like I'm more likely to run into, like, Undead than I am to run into, like, Dragons, though. I guess it kind of just depends on what I'm going for, but... Wait, is there... Oh, does it just say, like, all of the specific... Oh, that's cool. I didn't know that. Okay, so it just... It does say all of the uh, augments. Okay, so you can view augment details. Okay, increases the likelihood of that, reduces the rate of which items deteriorate, augments your knockdown resistance, increases damage dealt when exploiting a hostile target's elemental weakness. Ooh, that's pretty dang good. That would be really nice for um, Mage, specifically. That'd be a really good boon. Augments your magic. I don't know what that means, but it's probably great. And then what other ones can I get is this. Reduces the duration of meditations. Okay. Extends the duration of enchantments and invigorations. Augments your stamina recovery speed. That one's nice. That one's really, really nice. And I imagine I get that one at nine. Classic marketing. Absolutely. Makes sense. I do want to acquire this. I'm not going to equip it. But I do want to buy it. Just so I have it for later. Because I, I will probably get some of those skills. What does this guy have? Metal, augments physical defense, likelihood of being targeted by foes, carry additional weight. That's something I want, that augmentation right there. Hastens recovery and downed or crawling, okay. Oh. I mean, I could just unlock all of these, really. Increases your max stamina, that's nice. Ooh, that, that would be good. Because if that could affect spells, that'd be incredibly nice. Which I imagine it would. Ooh, slightly restores health when you deliver the killing blow. That's pretty nice. I wonder if that proceeds past the, uh, the burnt parts. Augments your strength. Interesting. Increase max health, improves ability to push and pull targets, break through opponent's guard, augments your knockdown power. Okay. So realistically, I should probably just acquire all of these. Just so I have them for later. Yeah, 100%. KC for sure. Uh, I didn't miss anything, did I? No, I didn't. Okay. Yeah, so I'm not convinced. That, I mean, I do kind of want to buy this just in case I run into, like, I'm going to buy it just in case I run into any undead, like, kind of along the way. I'm not going to equip it right now, but everything else so far I can't just really see using, to be honest. Yeah. Chester can probably get some stuff, though. Whirling Arrow. Fires a powerful sword that delivers a barrage of hits. Effective at overrolling smaller targets. Ooh, that's kind of nice. Drenching Shot. 
Whirling Arrow seems pretty interesting. Uh, let's see. It's pretty nice for groups. Manifold Shot kind of seems basic, so we can replace that at this point, I think. Okay, he has all those. Augments, Radiance. Sure. Might as well spend it on that. I didn't mean to actually get rid of that one. There's no point. I have more slots to go through. Always a pleasure. Oh. Okay, well, I got a bunch of crap. Because <laughs> I bought all the vocations. Okay. Uh, I was not expecting that. All right, well, I need to I need to go drop some of this off because that's no bueno. I'll keep it for later just when I switch because I will absolutely want to switch to each one of these at some point. So dropping stuff off is going to be very vital. Wait, why am I over income? Oh, it's because all the weapons. It's not all the armor. It's just all the weapons. That I see, I see. That was a crap load though. Holy smokes. The foremost hospitality in all Vernworth. Much obliged. Don't have much experience with real tech, but PC also uses it. Got out of your running through GoLXR, which has its days numbered. Yeah. I'm not too familiar with GoX Go XLRs. Um I've heard similar things about it, like you've said, with being limited on time and whatnot. Getting outdated, all that jazz. Well, but I know nothing about it if I'm being honest. Ooh, those do sell for a decent amount. Made some made some decent cash. And then we can sell those, because I don't particularly care about that. Holy cow, those sell for a lot. I'm not selling it, but that's a lot. 15,000, that's pretty decent. You can get some good money out of those if you really wanted to. I mean, realistically, it's probably going to go bad. If we're being completely honest. So, if all you check the price. Oh, well, I've already checked the price. It's been checked, my friend. I wish there was some different robes. I mean, these are these are different robes and they're better, but I wish there was more stuff. Like so far it seems like they haven't really gotten much new stuff in stock lately. I wonder when that becomes the case or if I have to find other towns. I haven't upgraded my uh many thanks. I appreciate the My staff in a minute, but we'll see. Funny because they released a driver for a turn on Windows, but the whole back end is completely changed. Oof. Gotcha. Big oof. Okay. Meniscus. Unfettered claw. That's quite a lot better, magic wise, and it's not even upgraded. And it's something I can actually use, so I might as well get one. Can I get something else for 230? I'm assuming that's probably better for... Wait, where's Chester? Why isn't he allowed to see any of these bows? What the hey? Is he just not near? Just a friendly reminder that everyone here is officially members of the Yeti gang. Absolutely. Is it just that he wasn't close enough? Is that what the deal was? Can you guys come over here? I shall return. I don't know if that's the case, but it's kind of lame if it is, but yeah, it is. Okay. All right. So is this better than your bow? It is better than his bow, but it's also $17,000, but it's almost like double the damage, which would help him out kind of a lot. So I think I'm going to do it. Okay. 
Okay, and then we upgrade this, absolutely, because we can. We can upgrade it again. And we need Great Griffin Claw. Okay, so we haven't killed a Great Griffin, I suppose. Don't mess trying to find all the best optimized parts for your PC build recommended from the manufacturer. Major motherboard. Gotcha. Big oof. The devs for the software got laid off. Oh, I see. Yeah, I'm I am not that. That is for sure. I, I wouldn't call myself very intellectual when it comes to, like I said, just PC stuff in general. I know a few things here and there, but like I said, definitely nothing nothing crazy. He could use some better armor, but I'm kind of broke now, so. Do come again. At least better damage is where we're going here. Better offense rather than defense is, is probably what I would like to have anyhow. So. Okay, I don't even remember what we were doing. We were running around for so long. Okay, we got to talk to Captain Brandt, so let's do that. Man, this game just got me hooked, man. I'm enjoying the heck out of this game, which is great. Any ideas as to how we might reach it? Nope. Oh, Tug, no worries. I mean, that's that's the whole point of a chat. Chat. <laughs> chat. Chat about whatever. That is the reason it is there. I feel like he should be there, no? I guess he, oh, I think it has to be night, huh? I suppose we could just sit here and wait, huh? Doze off, yes. We Downed himself on a slide, oof. I believe I can guide you to the person in question. Uh, we should be here. We're just dilly dallying. Definitely an off topic. No, no worries. Yeah. Yeah, no worries. Don't even worry about it. So, like I said, it's it's. I mean, it's a chat. You can chat about whatever. It doesn't have to be about the game. It's all about making a community of people that want to chat together. That's really the whole thing, to be honest. Exactly. Zeros has it exactly right. Like, if you didn't want people to chat with about random topics, you'd just go to YouTube. That's where you find the specific stuff that you're looking for. Yeah, it, it'll definitely get more knowledgeable as I have to kind of do stuff with my PC. Like, as things start to break or as things start to need to, like, be maintenanced or swapped out kind of a thing, it'll it'll be more of one of those things where I can actually, like, get more information on it and stuff. So, there he is. Welcome to the we serve all manner of fine ales here. You shall not, because I'm broke. Greetings, your majesty. You will want to hear this. Tis, tis not a matter for prying ears. Okay, we'll hustle it up. If you don't want people to hear. Literally, goes, I can do this all day, then bop. <laughs> That's great. Classic pawn move. There is much we ought to tend to. If we are to strengthen Classic. the claim as a true arisen. Wow, there's a uh, there's a lot of stuff here. You've done a fine job culling those monsters, your majesty. Tis common knowledge among the people that towards you, the number of those who seek out this tavern in the hope of an audience with the arisen grows by the day. Didn't know Squat back in 16 or 18. Can't remember when I got my pre-build, but it com it's becomes addicting. Should yeah. Continue to display I'm not really like a big technical person, to be completely honest with you. No like, deny your I don't really focus a lot on technical details and stuff, really. And here, it slips it's just not It's not something that I'm super passionate Quite about, if I'm being honest. Take this. It is interesting to know, like, basic stuff, you. like, you know, as needed. But getting into, like, the depths of certain things is, is just not really, not really something I'm too keen on. Ooh, an expeditioner's cloak that looks interesting is it better though that's the that's the ultimate question it is overall better yeah and it fits it fits the look better to be perfectly honest i can't give this to anybody though like that's kind of the thing is like i can't it seems like they can't wear this for some reason i don't know why I'm going to try giving it to Chester again and see if he can wear it, but I doubt it. Oh, now he can wear it. I don't know why he couldn't wear it before. What the heck was up with that?
kind of just looks ridiculous with that. I mean, the poncho doesn't look too bad, but it doesn't really give him anything specific. This gives him an extra defense, so we'll just go with that. Less magic defense, but better knockdown resistance, so... Game. I'm game. Went from Xbox, PlayStation to PC. What stuff am I into? Gaming. That's about it. I'm just into playing games. Trying to get as good as I can at them. That's that's really my my biggest passion, if I'm being honest. Yeah, talk to this guy about uh, some other stuff. <clears throat> that and um, recently I've picked up video editing, obviously for like content creation and stuff like that. But I actually do really like it. It's a lot of fun. A minister. Even if I don't get like any views on my content or anything like that, I still have a good time editing. It's it's fun. I I I get a laugh out of it. I just sit here and laugh at myself, so it's worth it for me. From the pains he took to remain on scene. Total chat at games, that that something like that. This delivery kept away from prime <clears throat> yeah, I I tend to like games that are challenging, so I try to I try to do my best at getting a uh, game that can challenge or be difficult, so I can you know overcome it. Obviously, there's there's a bit of a line to that. Like if it's a game where it's like okay, this is challenging, but it's challenging in an artificial way by like increasing things where you can't necessarily overcome it with skill like you're getting overwhelmed by a number of mobs and there's no way to like handle that number of mobs and it's just artificially increasing the difficulty um things like that 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 kind of stuff i don't particularly care for but like if it's something that i can actually overcome by getting better and actually learning the skill on how to do it then that that's kind of the difficulty that i'm into i absolutely love dark souls yeah he bids you to that's one of my favorite series of all time the minister's chambers that's kind of kind of what started me on that journey. To be honest, nothing compares to the excitement of embarking on a new adventure. There's a couple of Souls likes that I've enjoyed, like um, Remnant, Remnant, and uh, Remnant Two. Those are Souls likes with guns, and I can't get enough of those guns. Oh hey, I found Mildred. Uh -huh. I have an eye for people, and my instincts tell me you're of trustworthy it, ilk. It came full circle, Zeros. It, it had to happen eventually. I'm in a bit of a quandary, you see. I'm to be gone for a week, with no one slated to mind the house in my stead. Am I cracked on keyboard and mouse, or would a shitty keyboard and mouse player be able to do it? I'm hearing I have to use a controller. Well, welcome in, Lenny. I hope you're having a great day so far. And I am a garbage PC player as far as keyboard and mouse goes, I'll tell you what. So, uh, you don't need a lot of technical skill. If you're talking about this game specifically, not, you uh, you don't need you tenants. don't need much there, skill-wise. I'm, I'm pretty sluggish when it comes to keyboard and mouse. I come from controller personally. Um, and so, I'm playing this on a keyboard and mouse right now. And yeah, you definitely don't need the skills for it. You can, you can absolutely play it without it. My game is about to get better. We sh we shall see. Yes, we shall see. I'd be much obliged. People that play Souls likes astonish me. I don't get the patience personally. Oh, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure. <clears throat> yeah, the thing about it is, it's like I I have like when it when it comes to like games, like I I definitely do get frustrated from time to time. But it's like it's more of like a passion frustration. Like I'm enjoying myself in frustration, if that makes sense. Like I'm having a good time. But it can be frustrating from time to time. And I'm sure like a lot of people who are passionate about something can absolutely feel the like feel that same way. Uh thank you so much for that follow, by the way, Lenny. I appreciate that. Um but yeah, like if, if you're passionate about something, you can probably kind of get the idea of like you're so passionate about something that it kind of frustrates you a little bit. I don't know. But uh yeah, no, I, I really love that stuff. In the end games. So I'm all about it. Follow me if you would. Where did you go? Wait, did it not select the quest? It's not. Pray, follow me. I know the way, so there's no chance of our getting lost. All right, Tiff. I'll let you lead the way, I suppose, just this once, since you won't stop attempting to. We're here, Master. You've come. I have. Glad to see you, friend. 
So, what say you? Would you care to live here in my absence? As I've said, you needn't worry about tending to the place. Sure, I'm down for that. Many Asked my parents to give me Bloodborne, not really knowing what it was. Just looked cool until I started the game, and I was like, well, why do the graphics look so aged, huh? <laughs> Yeah, the thing about Souls games, for the most part, is, like, their character creators are kind of mostly ass. Elden Ring is decent, but for the most part, like, we will find their character creators are garbage. You don't really ever play the game for the character creator, for the most part, and then you just, uh... Ooh, nice. So this is, like, a little home, huh? Interesting. But yeah, like, and the the graphics of some of the older ones aren't the best. Elden Ring's pretty solid. They're, they're definitely not the best graphics out there, but they're, they're pretty good, and they've come quite a long ways, like, especially with, like, Sekiro and uh like i said elden ring but okay so this is like a little hot yeah are we supposed to just like chill for a week or what's up fill your obligation to mildred by frequenting her dwelling for a week okay easy enough but my network went out uh wanted to say i'm gonna be right back okay no worries Tug, for sure realized it was a souls like and then you were like oh god <laughs> yeah no i i love those i love those a lot actually i i even have a tattoo um, from the series because I, I really enjoy them so much. They're, they're definitely one of my top favorite series of all time. They, they don't fill the slot for the best game of all time for me. Um, but, uh, they're right, they're like right there. Like a, a smidge off. Is Sekiro the hardest souls? Like, I would say yes. Sekiro or Dark Souls 2, a lot of people would say. Um, Bloodborne can also be a contender for that as well. Just kind of depends on the person. Because Bloodborne, uh... Excellent find. Bloodborne is one of those games where it's like, it's the fastest paced type of Souls-like. And so, it's a lot harder to get the timings down because you have to be a lot quicker. Um, but as long as you use the, uh, the gun, and you can get down the, uh, the parrying essentially with the gun, it's, it's a breeze. At least for me, I, I say that, but I, I've played quite a significant amount of hours of those games. And I make it, whenever a Souls-like game comes out, I make it a, uh, a priority to get all the achievements. So, not that that's like the biggest deal ever, because there's like challenge runs and stuff out there like that. But yeah, I, I always at least get all the achievements. And I, I've done uh, one challenge run so far on a Souls-like, which was Remnant 2. And it was uh, a secondaries only challenge. And I only used my pistol the entire game instead of using my primary. I didn't use any other damage or anything else. And I have it up on my YouTube channel, actually. Come back in seven days. Gotcha. Yeah, so I guess I just need to swap quests then, huh? Search Allard's Chambers. Yeah, that's really the only thing I can do right now, I think. Hold on, I'm going to grab a drink real quick. Didn't even finish the other one. What am I doing? I'm out here getting another drink and I haven't even finished the other one. Rookie. I thought I finished it, but I guess I didn't. Well, so much for that, I guess. Um okay, well it's the dead of night, so I could go do that right now. I do I do actually need to stop by the end though. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter right now. I could go do this real quick and then stop at the end afterwards. Let's see, map. Okay, so I'm assuming I have to go back through the front gates again, like the original first time. It seems I've collected a few too many things. Perhaps I ought to be more selective in future. Nah. We gotta pick up absolutely everything. The ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. No harm in picking a few. I would appreciate your. You are the arisen. Follow me. Again. Woo! We're getting the escort treatment again. I take the weirdest route, dude.
or your slack a lack and guard if your shift's just begun. Tis best you move along. Pray be cautious, Your Majesty. Well, we're being cautious. Did the chest respawn in here? No, but there is money. I'll take that. Freebies. That's incredible. Okay, so I don't exactly know what I'm looking for. Oh, I could just walk on in here, huh? Okay. Unimpeded and everything, man. Eh? I'm a dark in here. What am, what am I looking for exactly? And search the minister's chamber? Okay, well, this is not the way. I doubt the minister's hanging out outside. This is the audience chamber, so this isn't the right place either. What do I do for work? Um, I work for a security company as a workforce um as a as a, a workforce uh specialist is, is what they call the title but it's basically like managing uh internal employee schedules and stuff like that close to kind of like an hr position ish where the f am i going i'm stuck on a pan Okay, so I'm assuming it's gotta be like up, maybe? So like up here, possibly? Been wandering around the palace, nobody tries to arrest you or anything. Yeah, it's kinda what I was thinking. I, cause I've ran quite, you know, past quite a few guards and they, they haven't seemed to give a darn, so. Like, all right, I'm down for that. Here we go, this is the magistrate's office. What business could be so Sounds like Skyrim, yep. At this late hour. All you need is a bucket and you can get in anywhere. I would not presume to know, my lord. However, it must be a highly sensitive matter for the regent kin to request a private audience. Oh, perhaps the boy has finally grown wise to the benefits my favor can bring. <clears throat> my lord. Oh, unring your hands, you fool. As if anyone in this palace would dare say a word against me now. If Wilhelmina calls, Wilhelmina, huh? Tell her to await me in my chambers. I will. Okay. You heard that Allard was summoned by someone. Did he leave? Is that him? Oh, we searching. I mean, to case the place. I don't see anything of use at the moment. There's a window. Um. Okay. I feel like this is kind of a maybe thing we should be doing, but I also don't see anything out here, though. So... It feels like this scroll is what I should be picking up. That looks the most important out of everything in the room. Nope, nope. It's broken now. Sorry about it. Okay, well, I feel like it wouldn't be out here because I don't think I can go anywhere out there. Can I start breaking stuff? Is that what the deal is here? All right, well, we're just going to get some flame going, I guess, and start burning the place down. I don't, I don't know if that's the thing to do. It probably isn't, but it sounded like a fun time, so we might as well. This feels like the thing I should be grabbing right here. Oh, oh, okay. Secret walls, huh? Okay. I did not expect that. That was the last thing I expected. Surely none more important than this. I speak of the ascension of the sovereign. Hmm. 
secret formula. Yeah. They got the goods hidden behind the secret wall there. Indeed. But that, your grace, would be <coughs> better discussed in the presence of your mother. Would it now, Allard? Dip. I'm assuming we need to dip. Will this catch me? Sure, we're gonna find out real quick, ain't we? Nope. 